It's okay. Come, the stars await, and we mustn't keep them. Captain. expanse. It's easy to forget sometimes. You can say that again. But we made it. To Zega Grande Skydom. never ended? To me, seeing the world with everyone is so much fun. I sort of wish that it could go on forever and ever. You read with mine. The ship's flying steady again. Let's go check on the others. Pretty tall. Oh, now that you bring it up, I guess I've never thought about it before. Hey, can I ask you something? What do you think is at the end of the world? No idea, but I'm dying to find out. Same here! We'll leave no cloud unturned! <laughs> <laughs> On the other hand, we know there's at least two things waiting for us out there. First is Estelucia, the island of the Astrals, and second is your dad. I can't imagine what adventures we're in for next. Uh-huh, but that's what makes them so exciting. It's all about the mystery. <laughs> you and Lyria are totally in sync. <laughs> You're certainly in high spirits, Lyria. <laughs> I'm just excited to start a brand new adventure. Me too. Who knows what we'll find. Ah, oh, man, feel that wind flowing through your hair. <laughs> it does have a certain 
nostalgic quality to it. Wait. Does that mean you've been to the Skydom before, Rosetta? Oh, sweetie. <laughs> I can't start giving away my secrets now. Aw, you never give me a straight answer. Because you've got no filter. Maybe you'll understand when you're older. Zip it! I've told you a bunch of times, stop treating me like a baby! She's right, Rackham. Eo is a mature, sophisticated lady. Two against one ain't fair. I'm counting on you, Eo. And you won't be disappointed. My magic's getting stronger every day. Ugh, if anybody's the immature one, it's Rackham. Oh, Eo. Just forget about him. Think about these new skies we get to explore. Skydom reminds me of my younger days. Got me falling in love with the skies all over again. But you can rest easy. I'm keeping an eye on the horizon. Anything comes close to the ship, and you'll be the first to know. Think we'll see monsters? Hard to say. But if I know these airways, the skies will turn on you when you least expect it. Why don't you go check on the rest of the crew? I got things covered up here. We're on the verge of entering a new Skydom. No knees up now, Captain. <laughs> Seems like everyone's in high spirits. Should be seeing signs of civilization soon. I hope the island has a hotel. We got monsters! Lyria's in trouble! Get to her quick! How'd I miss a whole flock of what? Birds. Were they hiding in the clouds? Eo! Rosetta! You two handle the lizards on the port side! On it, yelling jerks! Out of our way! Just... <laughs> Should do it. Nice move, bud. Don't move. Yeah. Show him. How's this? Perfect. Now we can make a break for Lyria. Captain, go to Lyria. Showed those losers. <laughs> <laughs> you can't mess with the best. <sighs> <laughs> we did it.
wouldn't. Ticket people! Evasion's gotta be iffy. 
Everyone, hang on to your butts! Wow! You're gonna kill us first, Jackal! Yeah! yeah! You see that? It appears we're still alive. That's a start? Yeah. Bahamut's near the bow. Now's our chance to attack! <laughs> Okay now. Sheesh. <laughs> really had me worried there. I... <sighs> Lyria! Lyria's voice echoed through the darkness. It was familiar. Painfully familiar. Just like the day we met, before this whole long journey began. Though I could barely use my sword, I tried to protect Lyria from the Empire. I almost died. But then... You protected me. Now it's my turn to save you. Take my power. Let it guide you. Let it become your strength. I know you can do this. Our lives are linked. While I may not fully understand how, Lyria gave half her life to save me. Her gift gave me the push I needed to pursue my own quest, finding Estelusia, Island of the Astrals. It was a fabled place at the end of the sky, where dreams are said to come true. Lyria and I not to mention our ever-growing crew, are still continuing our search. But someday... Someday we'll find it. Then, finally, the life link between us will... Huh? Where... am I? Oh, right. Lyria fell from the ship. Then Vern and I leapt after her. <sighs> you gotta wake up! Swan, open your eyes! I said wake up! <sighs> you okay, buddy? You know? <sighs> Heavy 
repeat that dream about Lyria again? Maybe you bumped your head on the way down. Uh, speaking of Lyria, I didn't see where she fell. She should be close. Let's search the area. Dang, this forest is huge. Don't get us lost, okay, pal? Everybody's worried sick. Awesome. Wonder when we'll see him again. It looks like the path continues behind that ivy. Can you clear it? Looking good. Nice. Now we can move on. Close call. I'd almost given up hope. Thank you for saving me. <laughs> We're just happy you're safe. Now, let's lose these trees and meet up with the crew. Seems you. Nice. 
What's this? Nice find. Ugh, more monsters. You ready? <laughs> Really angry. You missed. 
Forgive me for being late, Captain. Hope you saved some fun for me. Ooh, looks like everyone's no worse for wear. Oh, thanks for the save, Oigan. Lyria, about what happened with Bahamut. Do you have it under control now? Yes, I think I do. Uh, why did it flip out on us? I don't really know. Well, hanging out here isn't gonna help. How about we head back to the Grand Cipher? I'm with Eo. Better get moving before more monsters get the munchies. In that case, maybe we should follow this trail instead. I have a feeling it leads to a nearby town. Doesn't that sound like the perfect place to learn more about Zega Grande? Let's go check out that town, then. Yeah, that's a good idea. What we need right now is information. Then it's settled. Into town we go! Huh, wonder if they got any plump, juicy apples. Oh, Vern, you're always thinking about food. <laughs> Look who's talking! Uh, my tummy always picks the worst time to growl. <laughs> you heard Lyria's stomach. Let's go find that town. Oh, wonder what kind of city it'll be. Can't wait to find out. You know what I'm wondering? How'd you guys fall from that high up without a scratch? It's a miracle. Good question. Maybe the canopy broke our fall. In any case, we got lucky. Hey, any Skyfarer who tells you life ain't about luck is a liar in my book. Awesome! Look! I see building! <laughs> Seems like a pleasant place to unwind. Only one way to find out. Let's go!
boy. This town is nice. Check out the airships. Probably got a strong trade network going. Kinda reminds me of good old Port Breeze. We should look for a place where Lyria can rest. Me? But I feel fine. You've had a rough afternoon today. You shouldn't push yourself too hard. I know, but we're in a brand new town and I want to explore it with everyone. Well, Captain? Enjoy some time to yourselves, everyone. Yay! <laughs> Where do you guys get your energy from? <laughs> if Lyria's up for a little excursion, then I don't see the harm in it. In the meantime, I'll grab the Grand Cipher. Should be a dock around here somewhere. As for me, I'm hankering to try the local brews they got in these parts. We just got here and you already need a drink? What's with you, geezers? What? I deserve a refreshing cocktail after a long hike. Ugh, you don't deserve anything. <laughs> You're all too much. Anyway, after exploring for a bit, let's meet back at that big building over there. Take a look around. I can't wait to explore. I love visiting new places for the first time. <laughs> I have to say, you're a real lifesaver. Well then, see you next time. It's always a pleasure. Ah, come again. Well, what do you know? <laughs> yeah. It's Lyria! And the captain the boat! <laughs> you made it all the way to this item, too? Boy, you really do get around. You might just say I'm everywhere. Everywhere the cash flows. <laughs> <laughs> Right there makes some fighting mine weaponry if you need some new gear. <laughs> ah, you must be the one Ciro mentioned. Let me take a peek at your gear. Know where to look if we need to sharpen our weapon. <laughs> you can say that again. Now, back 
to goofing off. Excuse me. What should we do first? So many choices. I smell a new mission. Yeah. <laughs> <sighs> but... Welcome, welcome. I have big nap for all your travel. It never hurts to have some backup, right? come a long way since we met on Freeman. How much she knows about magic? I still can't believe she's younger than me. Ooh, that's so grown up. An elegant lady knows the importance of looking her best. I see. I still don't know anything about makeup. You're naturally pretty, but a dab here or there could bring out a whole new you. Really? I don't know if that's me at all. How about this? Next time we'll do our faces together. With Rosetta's tutoring, of course. Aren't you curious how Lyria will look, Captain? Sounds like a good idea. <laughs> Maybe I can be a sophisticated lady, too. Gee, what a selection. I don't know what most of this stuff is for. Uh, this town seems pretty chill, huh? Once we found a key. What's Rosetta doing? Probably. Hi, Rosetta! Nice of you to drop by, Lyria. Come to see my part of town? Actually, I wanted to ask you how I could help the crew. Is that so? Well, I'd say there's no need to stress out about it. But I want to be useful and do my share. Oh, dear. <laughs> I think you might be overthinking this. Still. Isn't there something I can do? Let's see. Guidebooks are pretty useful. Ever thought about writing one? Write my own guidebook? Just jot down the fun things you've seen and done. Whatever you want to share with us. Better than complaining all the time. That's like the opposite of being helpful. You're right. Okay, I'll write the best guidebook ever. <laughs> I can't wait to read it. Such a refreshing breeze. 
Yep, that's locked up tight. <laughs> I can't wait to see more of the town. Rackham headed straight for the docks, huh? Huh. Airship of that size is a first for me, but I reckon I can handle her. Ah, uh, sorry for pushing you guys. <laughs> Shucks, it ain't nothing. I'll leave this spot empty, so go ahead and fly her in. Thanks a million. I'll get right on it. Rackham, hi! Well, look who it is. I managed to find a place that can patch up the Grand Cipher. Just got done haggling with him. Um, I'm sorry the ship got hurt. That was my fault. Whoa, whoa, what are you talking about? You had nothing to do with it. But I... Look, it was a random accident. No one could have known our dragon friend would go all crazy. It's not your fault, Lyria. Yep, no one's blaming you. Captain knows best. So quit feeling guilty about it, okay? Okay. Thanks for cheering me up. There's that smile. Besides, we're in a new skydom. Let's see some more enthusiasm, huh? Anyway, I'd better go move the Grand Cipher before anything happens to her. Go have fun. I got the ship covered. <sighs> Breeze feels almost welcoming. Like an old friend. Eugen's already uh, making. Oh, hi, Captain. Enjoying yourself? Oh, brother. At least one of us is. That's for sure. Come here. Let you in on a tip I heard. Word is there's a village that runs a mining operation on a nearby island. It's got an altar dedicated to. Get this. A primeval god. And when this god stirs up a wind, loads of ore gets exposed, ripe for the plucking. Then, this town takes those mined ores to make the finest jewelry. We'd be rich if we got in on the action somehow. You're catching my drift? Anyway, gonna stay put and sniff around for more info. I'll let you know what I hear. See you later, Captain. One more for the road. <laughs> Ooh, I'm getting hungry just reading the menu. Look at today's special. Everything looks tasty. What do you want to eat? I'm thinking the cheese fondue. Here's what the menu says for the fondue. Luscious, melty cheese. Dip bread and veggies as you please. Oh, it all looks so good. So then. Catalina, training again. Guess old Mill. Hi, Catalina! What you doing? Thought I might get in some training. I once spent hours practicing my strikes. Oh, no wonder you're a master swordswoman. <laughs> Not yet, I'm afraid. Maybe I'm halfway there at best. 
You're no slouch either, buddy. But I wonder who's better, you or Catalina? I don't mean to brag, but... <laughs> it's hard to say at a glance, though it might be fun to cross swords sometime. <gasps> you mean like a sparring match? I wouldn't know who to root for. Then why not both? Oh, you're right! There's no rule that says I can only pick one side. Uh, Captain, before we proceed any further, I have just one thing. Make sure to check our mastery points from time to time. Battles may begin to feel tense if we don't sharpen our skills. how it's done. Well, all right. I love learning new stuff. Ready for action! Can't wait to try this out! I'll practice day and night. I mustn't fall behind our captain after all. What I say? Good. If you're done looking around, we can start heading to the meetup spot a little early.
ready for some action? Yeah. So then? Meetup spot was somewhere around here, right? Are you done looking around? Yeah, I think I've seen everything. Same. Let's take a quick break while we wait for the others. Look, it's the Grand Cypher! Oh, yeah! Rackham did say he'd bring her in for repairs. Can I tell you something? I heard what you did when I was falling off the ship. I felt so happy knowing you sprang to my rescue. We've been through a lot together. Visited new islands, met new people. It hasn't always been the safest trip, but you've always been there to protect me. I just wanted to say thank you. And since our lives are intertwined, let's make the most of our journey together. Yeah. <laughs> now my face feels a little hot. <laughs> That's so true. Hmm. Doesn't it smell nice? <laughs> sure does. <laughs> Sorry, kept y'all waiting. Cypher's officially in the shop. Nice work. Hey. Thanks, Rackham. So, we've got time to burn, it seems. Anyone want uh, Almost forgot this. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You guys hear that? All right, I'm off. Pardon my rudeness. I, uh, don't do well with lizards. Hey! I ain't no lizard! It, it can talk? I do beg your pardon. We didn't mean to startle you. And we certainly don't intend on starting any trouble. Actually, we're a crew of humble skyfarers. This is Vern. I assure you, he means no harm. If anything, he's quite the lovable dragon once you get to know him. Uh, you've got it all wrong, Catalina. I'm a cool dragon. Huh. Skyfarers, you say? Oh, allow me to introduce myself. My name is... <sighs> Roland, you've got to help us. A tornado suddenly hit our village out of nowhere. A tornado? Could something have angered Tempil's primal beast? Huh? Remain here in Folka. I'll handle the rest. My apologies. It seems I'm needed elsewhere, so I'm afraid this is farewell for now. Hey, wait! He 
sure ran off in a hurry. And I heard him say Primal Beast. We should follow him. suddenly lit up, you know? And the wind was like a... whoosh! And that primeval god is not happy. Slow down, take a few deep breaths, and tell me exactly what happened. Okay! Okay. I'm calm. An altar, fierce winds, and what they call a primeval god. Sound familiar? Yeah, it does. Smells fishy. It's got to be connected to Bahamut going ballistic on us. <sighs> that guy with glasses knows something we don't. Want to see if we can tag along? He could lead us to a clue. What do you think, Captain? Well, we can't ignore people in trouble. Exacto mundo! Right then. I know what I have to do. Time to get moving. Um, excuse me. Ah, hello again. The situation is a bit... out of hand, as you can see. If you need something from me, can it wait? I must leave town for a spell. Then I'll cut to the chase. Allow us to join you. Say that again? It seems you're in a predicament. Depending on the situation, we could be of help. I appreciate the offer, I really do, but... You mentioned a primal beast, right? If that's the problem, we want to lend a hand. We had our own snag as soon as we arrived in this skydom. Bet your round of drinks whatever you're facing has to do with us, too. Simply put, our goals are aligned. It takes two to tango, wouldn't you say? I don't know. Hmm. Though, more hands would certainly be welcome. Very well. I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. Yay! Anything can happen out there. You should get organized before we head out. Afraid not. Lead the way. Oh, they'll never see me coming. I'll give it my damnedest. See that counter? That's where we can pick up new quests. Let's check back often, okay? Are you a Skyfarer, perchance? If you're looking for coin, I can help you find jobs from all over the Skydom. So, would you be interested in taking a quest or two? Or, uh, maybe more? <laughs> ship will depart shortly. Is everyone ready? Yep, we're good to go. Good. 
All aboard the airship. There's no time to waste. Do your thing, autopilot. So, I bet you're wondering who I am. Mm -hmm. I work for the Church of Folka, mostly as a vicar. Call me Roland. I'm Catalina, protector of this crew. Name's Rackham. Cheers. And I'm Eo. Eugen here. Rosetta. You can call me Ver. I'm Lyria. Nice to meet you. And finally, this is our captain. Wow. I can't imagine captaining a crew at your age. <laughs> well, I'm not exactly a slouch myself. You see, I'm kind of a Mr. Fix-It, handling all the odd jobs after church. From furniture repair to marriage counseling, I can mend it all. Results guaranteed. When Roland's on the case, nothing is impossible. <laughs> Too dramatic, huh? Psst. This guy's a few apples short of a bushel. Psst. He'll hear you, dummy. Glad you're with us. High five, fix it, dude. Uh, dude? <laughs> Once again, my name is Roland. Yep, heard you the first time. Cheers, fix it, dude. But it's Roland. We've got some time before we reach Tempeel, so would you mind checking on the others? Oh. Not the most luxurious ship, but I assure you she's skyworthy. Wow, this part of the sky is full of islands. Indeed, they form the archipelago, and one of them is home to Folka. So this other island we're flying to, will we be arriving soon? Yes, we'll be there shortly. I just hope the islanders are evacuating as we speak. You said we're going to Tempeel, right? What kind of place is it? It's a bustling mining village. All the rare metals they dig up put them on the map. What? Does anyone else see that? I mean, the wind around the island. You can actually see it. Huh, yeah. Why is it all weird? <laughs> the gales are reaching us from this distance? I suppose that confirms my suspicions. Okay, so 
sweetie? There should be more people here. Ah. Roland. We should talk. I see. The abnormal winds agitated the goblins who in turn attacked the islanders. We managed to escape, but the others... I pray the worst hasn't befallen them. Try not to worry too much. Just leave everything to Mr. Fixit. Thank you. I'll go spread the word. That being said, I can't just leave these people here unprotected. What should I do? He needs our aid, Captain. Did somebody call for goblin exterminators? We'll handle the goblins. Are you sure? That'd certainly take a load off my shoulders. Talk about having the right crew for the job. Thanks a lot. I'll come find you after I get all these people aboard the airship. If you happen to see any more islanders out there, could you give them assistance? Yep, you got it! Oh, I almost forgot to give you this. If anything happens, we can communicate with each other using this device. We can talk on this thing? Looks like a flower glued to a box. It's a type of transceiver. It'll allow us to talk over long distances. Aren't transceivers expensive? Are you sure you want to give us one? Yep, don't worry. I didn't pay for it. Since I put it together myself. Ah, check this out. It even has a nifty light attachment. Why don't you turn it on, Fern, when you want to grab everyone's attention? Might come in handy. Nice. You got skills, Fix-It Dude. <sighs> it's rolling. Huh. Who'd have thunk you could make sweet gizmos like this? Thank you. We'll definitely make good use of it. Follow that road, and it'll take you to Tempeel. Please, help anyone you see. I'm counting on you. Move it, people! Devil time! Don't mind if I do. Just a moment. This here's hallowed ground. A special aura keeps the monsters at bay. If you need to rest, find this crystal. You can even stock up on supplies and fix up your weapons. We're counting on you. But it won't stay that way for long. Just like that. Please, do everything you can to free them. That's the spirit! Evil pet! On my mark! Get him! You got it! Wow! And that was just the warm-up! Focus. Great. Focus up, Theo. Oh, 
Understood. There. That's the last of them. Now to set the captured people free. Everyone, get on board. We've been... Safe? Eo, take care of their injuries. I'm on it! Thank you. I'm just glad everyone's safe and sound. What would we have done without your crew? Skyfarers is something else. Thank you so much, everyone. But more settlements could be under attack. Better keep going. We gotta check on those people. Are the erratic winds causing the goblins to act violently? That's a big problem, it's true. Goblins don't usually go berserk like average monsters. Oh. Don't mind if I do. Pick up the pace, everyone! Hmm. Doesn't this island remind you of Port Breeze? Back when we met Rathom? This should do it! Oh, yeah! That's when we can just be the unofficial crew! I bet he was dying to join you guys. Where else would we find cooler crewmates? Oh, Judah! You joined after me! Just like that! On my mark! Here we go! There's mine! That was great! Hey, protecting you, young bucks, is what I live for! Oh no! The bridges are in pieces! We'll have to get our feet wet. Mind where you step, everyone! Watch out for the shooter! I'm moving as fast as I can! Keep those goblins occupied! We will, Roland. You just focus on flying. Yes, yeah, but... Nope! Never mind. You're right. I'll put my trust Close in you, call. Sky Fairy. Oh, now great. It's on. You know how to shoot bows. They'll need time to reload. That's when we charge. On my mark! All support! Uh, you guys rock! The honor's all See, mine. I can teach you a thing or two. We've made a decent dent in their numbers. Keep at it. Now's our chance. I've got you. you. Got Looking good. We turned the tide. Bring it on. I hear you. Just like that. Uh, on my mark. We've Much obliged. Should be safe to free the captives. Thank you. Thank goodness everyone's okay. Quickly, get on board. Don't worry, you're in good hands now. Oh, thanks. I was so scared. You did a great job holding out. Hoo-hoo! <laughs> what a show! I'm so pumped up right now! Uh, maybe I healed him a little too much. You did it! You saved everyone! Thank you! Oh no! The windmills have come under attack! But, next is... Nature is the windmill! 
Look at all those shiny rocks! Make sure you nab them all! People fleeing the area, they could see this as their big chance to expand. Either way, watch out. Ooh, shiny. Might be worth something. Hey! Timberwolves! They've even oh, learned yeah. how to tame walls. <laughs> An opening! You won't fall! Not now, not ever! Catalina, I'll protect you! Fall now! Rest in peace! Theo! We make a perfect Thanks, team. Burn. Yeah, that was not the best.
One more group accounted for. Nice! Give them back that sweet, sweet freedom! You're safe now. Hurry to the ship. Thank goodness. Don't give up, okay? I'm... alive? You're going to be fine. Can you walk, miss? Thank you, thank you, thank you! Those poor folk are safe thanks to you. Great job, everyone. Now, we should return to our search. Huh? What the... Heavens help us. There are others who haven't made it out yet. Oh no! This is awful! You have to rescue them! I'll lead the way! God! We'll speed ahead, everybody! I pray we're not too late. We made it, Roland. About to start fumigating the place. This ain't a lot. Put my mind on my Buddy, seriously? I'm at least five years older than you. You really can't believe how old I am. And which would make you how old? My lips are sealed. Together, we're almost there. Push through. We'll never back down. Damn it! Yeah, about now. Yeah. Follow me. Oh yeah. Thank you so much. Another heavyweight. What are these chucklehead brothers or something? <laughs> They should have sent more than a trio. You reap what you sow. Thanks for the heal. Here goes. On me! Tempest Flame! Ha! Catalina, I'll protect you! Fall now! Rest in peace! Dio! I'm on it! Oh, yeah. oh yeah! Your time's up! Do it again! <laughs> We're on a roll! <laughs> Armor break! guys were awesome. Just who are you guys? We're traveling Skyfarers, and we're here to rescue you. Chin up, everyone. 
Everything's going to be all right. Wait, was that Roland? Guess we really are saved. Let's quickly get you aboard Roland's ship. No, wait! Listen to me! We fled from the goblin fortress that lies deep in the nearby ruins. But our friends are still in there, and they can't make it out on their own. What's the call? Let's get those people out of there. <laughs> I knew you'd say that. Come in, fix it, dude. Roll in here. What can roll in do for you? We're gonna break some people out of some goblin fortress. So take care of things here. Got it. I know this isn't what you signed up for, but just be careful in there. Will do. Who's ready to do this? Y'all think this is the goblin fort we're looking for? <laughs> Gives me the willies. Be on guard. Oh, we meet again. Can I offer you a nice knick-knack in these trying times? Thanks for waiting, everyone. That sounded like a kid. Hurry! Is this like a coliseum? This place is crawling with goblins. It doesn't seem like they want to scuffle. No! Run! Get out while you still can! with that shield. That copper charges like a wild boar. But I reckon we can outmaneuver it. Close call. This is Roland. What's your status? We're going toe-to-toe -to -toe with this huge goblin jerk. Roger that. I'm on my way. Hold out until I arrive. Don't let up yet. Great. Right. I won't lose focus. Oh, no. <laughs> Thank you, Lydia. Now it's on! You reap what you sow. Time to fight. All through! Got it! Don't expend all your magic. I'm old enough to manage my mana, thank you very much. I'll finish this. Just like that! On my mark! Yeah, finish! It. Wow! That was just a spray to our blade! We fight as one! Well done! Bring it! Air detonation! 
Snap! Don't move! Aw, oh, thanks! Yeah, right vigilant. on the line. All right. Let's keep our wits. Right out! You keep your distance! Formidable crew in the skies. <laughs> See? Let's I can the teach you a thing or two. <laughs> Looking good. All together. There we go. Uh, Here's our chance.
Stray. Run away with your tail between your legs. Lyria, did you notice the wind throughout the battle? Yes, I'm sure of it. It has to be Tempkill's primal beast. Bingo. Guess this is where the real battle starts. Hello? Is everyone all right? What happened to the hostages in the fortress? Everyone's fine. They just need to rest. Stay still! Ow! Ow! Yeah... <sighs> We're alive! Oh, what a relief. I can't thank you all enough. So, what do you guys say to meeting the blowhard stirring up this storm? Wait, what are you talking about, Rackham? Told you before we left Folka, remember? The problem with a primal is our problem, too. I don't know about this. Maybe it's best to leave well enough alone. But if we don't calm down the primal beast... ...the situation on the island is only going to get worse. I hear what you're saying, but... Trust us. Captain. All right, I understand. I'm sure veteran Skyfarers know what they're doing. But if it gets risky, there's no shame in retreat. I still owe you a reward. You don't have to tell us twice. Thanks for the concern. Sit tight. The least I can do is drop you off a little closer. <laughs> Reminds you of our showdown with Tiamat, doesn't it? I was wondering why this felt so familiar. Good luck, and stay safe! Voting, isn't it? Let's hurry. <laughs> nice find. Whoa! This place gets way bigger on the inside. Oh. Look, everyone! Some sort of altar? Let's 
Get him! We're not jumping across yes, that way. Let's find a safer way to crawl. Yeah. Are you yeah. injured? Yeah. 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 You reap what you see. Just like that! Time to shine! You have it's got over! Let's hurry to the altar! Here's a little favor! Nope! Let's do it! Oh, let's go! That's all right! Say. You reap what you sow! Don't hold back! Follow me! Got him in my crosshair! They're wide open! Great job, team! Appreciate you! We fight it on my mark! When the going gets tough, or the tough get out of dodge! That way. But if we leave them be, they'll just try to ransack the town again. Well said. How's this? Prepare yourself. Hit them now. Leave it to me. Well done. And that was just the warm up. That should be the last one. There. Now it's a straight shot to the altar. Deja vu, but there's another lever here. Let's see. Hmm? Again with the goblins? Huh? Hurry, the altar should be down this path. Okay, it's the home stretch. How about no, no, no. Now I'm the one in your death area. Are you hurt? No, I think. Altar's a brother, huh? Hiking boots on. Hey. Today's been one hell of a welcome to the sky. We have one normal day. I mean, we are skyfarers. Kind of comes with the territory, don't it? Sure. But I don't know how many more death-defying escapades my heart can take.
ready for a fight. Yeah, come on. This ain't our first rodeo with a fry
Lyria, glad he's fighting on our side this time. Focus. Yorkin's power is starting to swell. Hold up. Did the demon pony just transform? It is a primal beast, after all. Are you expecting something different? You can tell primal beasts were weapons created by Astros. The powers are capable of untold destruction. Nice. But Let's after the this. war, they abandoned us here in the sky. Some took to the land. Some were deified. Still others found a home alongside Skycrest and helped advance great civilization. I fear it. Primal of Vitality. It blessed him kill with its power. How callous it is to twist this creative soul into an instrument of destruction. Payback's on its way. Darn right. Just don't get sloppy. This thing means business. I promise we'll save you. Its magic reserves are crazy. It keeps swinging attack after attack at us. Something about Kirikin's power feels unnatural. Huh? What do you mean? I'm not sure, but something isn't right. <laughs> Look at your <laughs> Just like that. All right. Now's our chance. Let's finish this. Uh, Tempest Blade. Oigen. Yep. Your time's up. On my mark! The move! Here! Lena! I'll settle this! Fall down! Get this! Here! I'm on it! Get me! Bring it! Get out first! Looks like Lyria's starting to get 
Okay, be at peace now. Thank you. And that's a wrap, folks! Booyah! Let's get off this rock and give Fix-It Dude the good news! Hold it. You guys see that ship? Ruby red for the hull? Sticks out like a sore thumb, don't it? It doesn't... It's not Lyria's doing. Hey. Lyria! What's wrong? It wasn't me. I didn't... I couldn't stop it. Friends of ours, I'd wager. Hmm. Now, they look like a fun bunch to tangle with. Do not deviate from the mission. We are simply here for a meet and greet. And you are? We've been waiting for you, Shaman of Salvation. Now, would you be so kind as to join us? <laughs> If you value your life, you'll leave us alone! Oh, fancy and challenge, huh? Fine, have it your way. I'll end this in 90 seconds.
gonna put up more of a fight. One left. He's a freak! How did he even get that strong? Let's go. O oh, shaman of salvation, long have we waited for this day. What? Shaman? Me? How uncanny. So much in common with the blue butterfly and seed hollow's energy. Oh, my apologies. You must be bewildered by this disrespectful treatment. I... Who the heck are you? And what do you want from us? Oh. How rude of me. You may call me Lilith. They the pilgrims of Avia. I their shepherd. And I will not rest. Not until we open the path to Utopia. Esther Lucia. Utopia? You just said us to Lucia, but that's the same place we're headed. Ah, truly? Our goals eclipse one another. Then I needn't prattle on. This meeting has proven quite serendipitous. I promise to take care of everything. Now, dear Sean, prepare yourself for glory. For a grand pilgrimage awaits us. We shall pave a new path to Estelucia. I don't think so! You don't get to make the rules on my watch! You fuckface! If... Let us return. You are unworthy.
Welcome to a new home. beside herself. <laughs> we can't afford to stop. We have to save Lyria. Whoa, try to cool down there, Cat. But I promised her. I promised her I would show her the outside world, no matter the danger. What if I can't protect her? What if I can't get her back? I refuse to break my vow. We know how you feel. <gasps> Captain! Glad you're back on your feet. You scared the hell out of us. I'm sorry, Captain. I wasn't strong enough to protect Lyria. Good news, folks! I got a lead on those ruffians who ambushed you! Really? Where did they take her? Tell me right now or else. Jeepers! Calm down, Catalina. Is that any way to say thanks for the help? Uh, of course. Sorry. It's quite alright. I know exactly how you feel, Catalina. With all you did for us, it's only fair that I do my part to help you. Besides, looking into the Church of Avia was fairly simple. The church? They did call themselves pilgrims. Oh! How are you feeling, Captain? Uh, much better. Glad to hear it. It's important to take care of yourself. So where'd those zealots march off to? It seems like they're taking Lyria to Latanya Island. Where's that? Fret not. I'll show you the way myself. Whoa, slow down, champ. First of all, we're Skyfarers. We can't be babysitting. Point made. I see we've severely underestimated you, Roland. <laughs> Look, the Church of Avia grows bolder by the day. They used force in Tempil and abducted Lyria, an innocent traveler. I cannot sit idly by and allow such deeds to go unpunished. I'm quite capable of handling myself in a fight, and will do my best to aid you. If I may? Every Skydom's got a bad bunch. If you're offering to help us with them, I won't say no. Hmm. Now, uh, about your ship. You know, the really big blue one? The Grand Cipher. Yes, that's it. The repairs on the Grand Cipher will soon be completed. I did a little work on it myself, and just wait until you see what I... installed. You what? No! Oh, silly me! I must have been rambling about something else. Moving right along. I took the liberty of procuring a new weapon and some armor for you, Captain. Your current gear has certainly seen better days, after all. <laughs> Sweet! That's real nice of ya! I hate to imagine Folka's fate if your crew hadn't shown up when it did. 
these small tokens of appreciation are hardly enough to convey our gratitude. <laughs> well, thanks all the same, Fix-It Dude. It's Roland. We're grateful for all you've done, Roland. All right, let's get a move on. Sure, let me pack my things and I'll meet you by the dock. See you soon. Lilith, enough is enough. Lyria's kidnapping is hit. <sighs> we'll save her, no matter what. Of course. I don't care how strong they are. I'm not... We're not giving up. Look. Lyria's grown so much since she met you. Almost every night, she would come and tell me about her day. And all the new things she experienced with you and the crew. And each time, I was more and more glad we all found ourselves on this journey together. I won't let it end here. I promised Lyria that we'd see the world. That we'd see the end of the skies. So I swear, we'll get her back. Together, as a crew. Lyria. I hope Eugen's not beating himself up too much. Hey, Captain. Can you ever forgive me? For what? Sorry, but I gotta apologize. See, I had a bad feeling the second I saw that red ship, and you've been through as much as I have. You develop a sixth sense for danger. I still ignored the warning bells. Damn it all. So much for calling myself a guardian. Can't protect a damn thing. Well, I ain't giving up on Lyria. I'm bringing her home. And nothing's gonna stop me. Oh, they'll stay. I'll show them what an old vet can do. Lost in thought. Tell me, Captain, how are you feeling today? Pretty good, actually. Ah, I see. I like that confidence. Thankfully, it looks like you've healed up just fine. But we can't wait around any longer. Our princess awaits her rescue. It's going to work out. Wow. Despite it all, Eo seems to... Hey, Captain. Say, you remember the promise I made with Lyria? We were gonna ask Rosetta to teach us how to put on makeup. I wonder if Lyria's crying right now. It must be scary being alone. <laughs> I can't stand it! We have to save her! Lyria... Pardon me. I heard what happened with Lyria. I'm not much use in a fight myself, but maybe I can help in my own small way. Please, take this! 
Did you wait long, Captain? Rackham looks ready to take off the second we say go.
sky, Ferrers. Want your weapons tempered? Always aim for the top. Huh. Well, look at that. I'll handle it. Wanna sell something? Let's see what you got. What should I strengthen? I'll handle it. Unlock its hidden potential. Always aim for the top. Come back sometime. think they're gonna do anything to her, do you, Captain? Either way, we have to save her. Damn straight. She's the ray of sunshine on our crew. Good thing we know where that red ship is going. Grand Cypher will hunt it down in no time. But once we catch him... Those punks are gonna pay for what they did. They can run, but they can't fly from the Grand Cypher. Not while I'm helmsman. He promised to meet up with Fix-It Duo. Let's head for the dock. Are you all ready for takeoff? I can leave at a moment's notice. Prepped and ready. Excellent. Then let's cast off. What in blue blazes is this? Like what you see? It's the latest in ether cannon technology. You did this? That thing looks like a recipe for disaster. You bet it is. See, a merchant I know's been asking me to test it out. This flagship model employs ethereal mechanics to increase range, accuracy, velocity. took Roland for a weapons maniac. By the way, Captain, how is the lifelink between you and Lyria holding up? It seems okay. Yeah, I think so too. So basically... And since they share the same life force, a healthy Captain means a healthy Lyria. Isn't that right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Considering they called her a shaman, I doubt they're out to harm her. They're yanking my chain. That's incredible! See? 
I had the exact same reaction. Gosh, you guys are such dorks. I take back what I said. These ether cannons are pure magic. <laughs> it seems Roland has quite the silver tongue. Next stop, Lotania Island. Our target is obvious flagship, the Ameritot. Let's go rescue Lyria. Hey, fix it, dude. Who died and made you captain? That's Roland to you. <laughs> <laughs> Seems useful. Oh. Training sure pays off. Can't wait to try this out! Nifty! Ready for action! I love learning new stuff. Ready for action. Well, all right.
Good stuff. Can't wait to try this out. Ready for action! Good stuff! Great! Potential. A little something for my arsenal. Wind's on our side. The Grand Cypher should get us there in no time. The Church of Avia, claiming Lyria was some kind of shaman of salvation, had ripped her away from us. We had no idea what they were after, much less what they had in store for Zega Grande. The most we could speculate? There had to be a connection between Avia's appearance and the incidents with Bahamut and Furikan. At the very least, Roland had an idea of where they were taking Lyria. Lotania Island. trying to outrun the Grand Cypher. Anything for salvation. What the heck? Don't they know it's rude to board without an invite? Yeah. 
have this much firepower. This is bad. They're shooting at us. Oh boy, at this rate, we'll be to pieces. The ether cannons are our only hope. Use them to return fire. Whoa, this is awesome. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, right up. <laughs> yeah, they felt that one. Oh no. Come on, Grand Cypher. You can write this out. You'll have to fight in close quarters. Is the broadside guns We've and been breached. Deploy the droids to both up. Prepare to intercept. Okay. So we're this? looking for the gun battery. Yeah, we know. We'll get rid of them. That's one gun battery down. They're targeting the guns. Stop them now. Here goes! On me! Tempest Flame! Ha! Wait a minute! What if we chucked it back at him? Hell yeah! No more taking pot shots at the Grand Cypher for you! Now the port guns are down! What in blazes is going on? They could finish it off! Can you disable their ship? Like, knock out the power? Then, uh, we'll have to sabotage its power regulator. Panacea! Now we're ready! Catch this! Armor break! 
Cypher in half if you don't do something. Then we'll have to destroy them. Come on, everyone. Step back from the grapnels. Something's not right. How's the ship? Can she still fly? Sure can. Oh, I wish I had a ship as amazing as yours. Now, to put her to the test. That big red ship zoomed into the cloud! We'll lose some visibility in there. Stay on your toes. Right into an ambush! I've had enough! Hey, Eugen! Cannon's up yet? I think we're good. Let's say hi with a bang. Show them we mean business with some cannon fire. Watch out for me! We've come way too far to get shot down now!
at 10 o'clock. Panacea! Great! This ain't funny, damn it! Everybody, hold on tight to something! Ah, ah son of a... Ether cannon's down! Heads up, you guys! We're being boarded! You'll never defeat us! That ship's going to drag us down with it if we can't pull away somehow. Any good ideas? Destroying the engine seems effective enough. Actually, that might be our only option. Can you handle it? It's as good as done! I don't feel like crashing today. Keep them back and capture them at once! You won't get near the armor top! The shaman is under our protection! That's some frightening firepower. I'm glad you're on my team. What can we say? Those bozos weren't even a challenge. All right, now to catch that ship. It's showtime, folks. Silver Wolf Corps, and strongest in the land! Bastard! Watch where you stick that thing! Who cares about a dumb pile of wood? You see, all that matters... <laughs> ...is the last man standing! Oh. <laughs> 
At least give me a challenge. We are to rescue Lyria. Then falling here is not enough. <laughs> Impressive. No one's ever made such short work of my unit before. I want answers, and you're going to give them to me. Why did you kidnap Lyria? Why, you ask? Because I live to test my might against the strong. Oh, this is going to be fun. That's a dumb excuse. I can't stand guys like him. Let's just not be on his butt! Watch my back! You're done! Alonzo, was it? You don't know who you're messing with. You reap what you sow. Those attacks are hard to avoid. Might be better to buckle down and guard. Let's patch you up. Thanks! Ready! Quite the improvement. the limits of his ferocity. Excellent! This is the most fun we've had in ages! The spirit 
It transformed. We're through storming death.
Oye. Treat. Really, you speak like a beast with more impulse than sense. If you're lying on the ground bereft of life, how will you explain yourself to Our Lady? <clears throat> Point taken. I could use a nice nap. But as for you, <laughs> the next time we meet face to face, only one of us will walk away. It'll be glorious! Dark! Red ship. Don't you worry. I've got eyes on it. They're flying towards Mount Nazalith. Whoa! Ah! Old girl's taking too much damage. Hope she don't fall. Damn it! Just gave her a tune-up too. Don't let us down, Grand Cipher. Let's move out. Snow 
storm. Whatever. It's not gonna stop us from finding Lyria. We chase after the red ship, straining to see through the flurries of snow. Lotania Island, home to frosty mountains, treacherous ravines, and desolate tundra. Out here, it's just white, white, and more white. The ship shivers in the blasts of icy wind. This place has got just one message for us. Keep out. those cliffs. Ride's gonna get a little bumpy. Something. Roland, a word, please. I saw a light in the distance before the storm hit. It was like the one in Tempeel. If that light is what I think it is. You guessed right. It's where we'll find the island's altar. And Avia. So they aim to drive another primal beast to insanity? Be that as it may, Lyria is waiting for us. Now is not the time to speculate. Look, I know we gotta go, but the ship's hurting. We won't get far without repairs. With a blizzard like this, all we can do is wait till it dies down. I'll go on foot. In this weather? Through a mountain? Do you know how dangerous that is? If anything, it might be safer. There's an old monastery nearby. I plan to meet a friend by the Sanctum. With her leading the way, you'll arrive at the altar come rain, sleet, or snow. Then she's our only chance! Come on! The trails are infested with monsters. But after seeing your handiwork, I'm sure we have nothing to worry about. Oh, I'm not worried about that. Thing is, I can't leave the Grand Cipher unguarded. Then permit me to repair her in your stead. She'll be ready to fly in no time. Look, it's not that I don't trust you. Don't judge a book by its cover. I'm Mr. Fix-It, remember? Repairs are my specialty. She's in your hands. Well, if Captain's on board with it. You're so a crybaby, Rackham. You still can't leave the Grand Cipher's nest. Oh, give me a break. Seriously, it ain't like that. Roland, can I trust you with the Grand Cipher? <laughs> On my honor, I'll do everything in my power to patch her up. Okay, gang. Let's get going before we turn into popsicles. Lyria needs us!
Kids? Hey, we don't get cracking soon. My get cracking soon. My buns are gonna freeze in place. Stay focused. Skeletons! Frozen skeletons! Dolly is packed with snow skulls I've ever seen. Don't let them surround us! Think before smashing those ice pillars. All that weight could crush you! I won't let you down! Bring him away! Take him out! Right away! Let's go! Hopefully we can get to the monastery quick. Right. Yeah. 
Good day, travelers. Although I bear no grudge against any of you, it would certainly behoove you to abandon your quest. I do beg your pardon. Milady, you were strictly ordered not to kill them. They went toe-to-toe -to -toe with Galanza and survived. This will merely slow them down a bit. But do keep a close eye on them. Ma'am. Now then, the Mountain considers your party to be uninvited guests. One wonders if Mother Nature will forgive this intrusion. That's it. I'm headed up to here with gravity. Stop. Nobody move. Jokesters intercepted us. Now we're at the bottom of some valley, fighting for our lives. Huh? It's not working. My guess is signal doesn't stretch all the way down here. We're on our own for this one. Buckle up. Now then. It's charging us. Let's end this. I'm ready. Nice work out there! I see you still have strength left for you. Here's a little paper. 
Shame we couldn't see eye to eye. Oh well. R.I.P., buddy. Ugh, that's it. No more puns this entire... What are we waiting for? I've been thinking, what does the Church of Avia want with Lyria anyway? Their leader, Lilith, said her goal was to reach Estelusia. She must have caught on to Lyria's unique. Come on! Whatever the reason, most tyrants abducted her. I won't let them off lightly. Agreed. But if we're gonna make a pain, we gotta climb first. Hold on, Lyria. We're coming. Ooh. one. Tasted lead? Come on! The monastery's in sight, you guys! Huh? No!
Your wish is my command. Looks like no one's home. Whoa! Did they need a door? Come, this Crimson thing? Thorns! Wait, what's that sound? Did they follow us here? With the blizzard picking up outside, we have no choice but to fight them off. Who's next? Oh my, thank you. Understood. If you insist. Yeah, that was great. great. I felt proud of that Let's one. Let's keep it up. Let's fall with them. Now's our chance. Let's do this. This place is bursting with water. Follow me. Rip got him. If you insist. Don't let up yet. Of course. Oh, certainly. Let's catch you up. I'm sorry to trouble you. I'm going! Beat him down! I love this. Nice try. They can come in like this. Come, Crimson Thorn! Gonna get real ugly. Finished! Thanks, Lancelot. It is my duty to protect you. Care to join me? It's over! Great work, everyone. <laughs> Thank you. Whose magic is this? Armor, time to shine! Nothing to it! <laughs> Quaint. Synergy. What do you think? Energized. A lovely Don't look at me! Traveling Skyfarers. I am Historia, Overseer of Malo's Monastery. Thank you for your assistance. You must be Roland's acquaintance. Indeed, I am. Did anyone from the Church of Avia come this way? Maybe a flashy red ship? Yes, and they've already disturbed the altar ahead. The primeval god it honors is most displeased. Then there really is a primal beast here as well. The god's anger manifests as a blistering white storm. I seek to quell its rage. Well, we're after those jerks that caused it. Maybe we could go together. The road forward is a sacred one, sealed to all but me. However, it is no place for outsiders. She means a lot to us! Please, let us come with you! Hmm... You've got to help us! Oh? Do I now? At least you aren't lacking in bravado. Yes. That fire in your eyes speaks of great tenacity. An unquenchable resolve. Very well. Do as you like. Yes! Uh, thank you. But be warned. Sacred grounds are not immune to the taint of malice. Do keep up. We won't hold you back. Lead the way. Oh, primeval god of Belfrost Dominion, bestow... Lead the way. Thy grace and God. 
guide us past the door of seclusion. The amazing mana reserve. I'm no stranger to ice based spells, but this is something else entirely. Ahead lies the Padam Saint. Where in a primeval god resides. Took us forever and a half. We made it. Another door blocks our path. Allow me. In one fell blow. Oh, primeval god of Belfrost's dominion, bestow thy grace and guide us past the door of seclusion. the welcome squad and i know how they're kicking when it's sub-zero if my incantation is interrupted the sigils will cease forming it demands my fullest attention you are can you keep the rabble occupied understood we'll protect you while you work your magic one fell blow heal thanks for the heal perhaps they find her intense magical all the more reason to stay focused Come what may, we stand guard! Yeah! Prepare yourself! One self blow! No!
guide us through the door. Apologies for my Heal. earlier instability. Thank you. Your skill is uh, unquestionable. Yeah. Wait till you see me get serious. I expect to be impressed. Let's do it. Drive to see the love who never ceases to amaze me. Hmm? The blizzard stopped. An ill omen. We must hurry. One sturdy looking door. But no match for me. Oh, primeval god of Belfrost's dominion, bestow thy grace and guide us past the door of seclusion. Your eyes on that one. It's deadlier than the rest. Protect Historia. You won't prevail. How's this? Here comes more from the bridge. Yeah! 
not falter. This war 
It would be a shame to stop now. I think I get it. Good stuff. Oh, that's how it's done. Ready for action. Nice. Ready for action! Nice! Yeah, I think I get it.
Well, all right. Can't wait to try this out. Ready for action. Exhilarating. New stratagems. Impressive. Excellent. I can feel the difference. Exhilarating. Excellent. will do the trick. It's all so clear. A little something for my arsenal. Oh, all right. Just living up to my potential. It's all so clear. will do the trick. Oh, fun! A little something for my arsenal. That's nice.
At long last. I'll look after you. It is far too quiet for my liking. <clears throat> the altar lies ahead. <laughs> Another foe. Historia! You name! What did you do to Lyria? Answer! I wouldn't interfere if I were you. Protect us. Lyria is staying. Us. If you will not return Lyria, so we shall take her by force. You're not the best. Come to the door. Embrace us. What's the big idea, Lyria? Why are you yeah. fighting with that torches? Come, please. Why did you kidnap Lyria? Oh, now he's got nothing to say. I don't like it, but we have ways of making him tough. You will pay dearly. <laughs> Move. Keep going! Why don't you for breakfast? He's strong as hell! First yeah. Alonza, now this dude. Where does Avia find these monsters? His name is Id, one of Avia's top three. Said to be the fighting strongest. No wonder he's so tough. But why would a man of his ferocity obey the church? He may be Lilith's son. Details escape me. But it would explain much. Big Jesus, oh, little Jesus, huh? With a board mob of great and all this, you think of yourself, man. It's very nice to ask myself either. We must get to her. This guy's too good. Can't get a clean hit on him. Time's up. Shall support you. Which means the reign of Astor's Blue. By Malone's Field, I find thee. What you do, should the primeval god remain unquelled, the sun will never kiss these skies again. Oh, my magic shall be with you. Thanks, Historia. We can take it from here. Wolves will hunt their prey to the end of the sky. We must fell the beast here. Zipping around like light. 
you get crosshairs on it. Follow its movement. That world's story like a big old fit. Follow. Stay calm. Learn its pattern of attack. What? Are you okay? Help is on the way. It's Mana is fighting. A massive ice storm is imminent. We're getting nowhere. Bring down the projectiles first. With its lights are on, it's a lot faster. Careful, you don't lose track of it. Keep fighting. You are not the clear of danger. There's too many. Hurry, I can take 
Quite the All together, you have my finish. Knock it out, guys. Last hurdle before the finish line, huh? I'm down to race. Your forgiveness. There you go. I shall not falter. Last hurdle before the finish line, huh? I'm down to race. I'm going. Surrender. Current comfort. Now. The gods' magic is wavering. 
Soon it will be over. You have my yep. blade! Sublime company! Onto so. the will lives in this place! Is anyone there? It's only temporary, but I fixed up the ship to get her flying again. Oh, goody. You don't sound very happy. Did something happen? Lyria, she... Uh, hang in there. I'll come grab you guys ASAP. <sighs> Captain... That's a bitter pill to swallow. It was a pitiful outcome, despite my presence. No, even I assumed they wouldn't control primal... I mean, the primeval gods. And there's the matter of Lyria's odd behavior. Her eyes were empty, as if her soul were caged. What's more, the blue choker she wore did not sit right with me. A blue choker? Like a collar around her neck? Could it be what, Roland? Is it a clue? Uh, possibly. Just a story I heard a while back. If uh, rumors are to be believed, the Church of Avia has been toying with a forbidden implement. Uh, what now? The Mind Sealer. A tool that binds one's will, leaving them open to manipulation. Given its inhumane nature, the use of such an artifact was supposedly banned. Ugh, if those buttheads are using something like that, then they're worse than trash! Hmm... Couldn't we just smash the cursed thing to pieces? I don't advise using force to break it. That would put Lyria's life in danger. Eh, I figured it wouldn't be that easy. What about nullifying its influence? I have a connection in Seed Hollow who knows his curios. I bet he could tell us more. You intend to ask the family Zothba? Informants don't cooperate without a price. Hey, deep down he's got a heart of gold. It'll work out. Wishful thinking. Thanks again, Roland. We'd be up the creek without you. Always glad to help. Remember, when Mr. Fixit's on the case, Nothing is impossible. <laughs> Got that right. Fixing our airship while it's stuck on a freezing mountain? Wow. Alas, I merely applied bandages. What she really needs is servicing in Seed Hollow. And on that note, I say we take to the skies. I'll show you the way. This ship needs a serious tune-up. We finally caught up to Lyria, but her eyes had lost their spark. When I called her name, she didn't respond. She didn't hear me. The Lyria we know and love? It's like she wasn't in there anymore. What is Avia plotting? With so many mysteries left unsolved, I get the feeling this is just the beginning. But for now, we need to dig up info on this mind sealer thing. We flew through the night without ever stopping. I can see our next island, hugged by dawn's warming light. Call that amber glow false hope. A 
but I'll take it. Welcome. This is Sega Grande Skydom's largest city, Seed Hollow. Hmm? <sighs> Whew. The good news is the Grand Cipher's gonna be okay. She's in good hands. Luckily, the ship escaped severe damage. Should be a quick fix. Sorry to keep piling stuff on you. Appreciate it, buddy. So about this family Zoppa or whatever, you know where to find them? I sure do. Their boss supposedly operates in this district. Information brokers don't exactly advertise to the public. He runs a bar as a front. Sounds like you've got his stuff together. I guess you'll find out for yourself when you meet him. Follow me. Let's start by heading to the main square. The bar should be in a back alley somewhere. Huh. Guess that's one way to design a ship. Always cool to see how other places build their rides. Wait till you visit the other districts. I'd love to give a grand tour. But... No biggie. Besides, sightseeing will be a lot more fun when Sirius back with us. Very true. I'd better start brushing up on my tour guide skills. Hello? Of course, Seed Hollow wouldn't be complete without a blacksmith. And the Lion's Rep, if you need to use their services, now's the time. They've got all kinds of flowers here. No wonder the city smells so good. I guess that's where the seed in Seed Hollow comes from. be an insult. But you could spot that thing from the next sky to over. It's been a fixture of this city since time immemorial. <sighs> After all these years, I still get emotional when I look at it. Just another 
hurts to have some backup, right? Sucks. <laughs> totally. So much freaking work to do. Hmm? Say, uh, don't you two work for Zothba? Who's asking? Ah, oh, snap, it's rolling. Where you been hiding, man? Thanks for always looking out for the boss. No, no, quite the opposite. Zothba has always been the one bailing me out. That info on Avia was spot on. <clears throat> but enough about that. It looks like you gentlemen are in a bit of a pickle. A pickle? Nah, man. We're swamped with work right now. Everyone in the family's fully booked. So, if you got biz with the boss, could you maybe go chill and come back later? Huh. I get you're busy, but we're also on the clock here. So, what I'm hearing is, once these errands of yours are cleared out, That'll open up Zothba's schedule. Is that right? More or less. Not like our mountain of work is gonna get smaller anytime soon, though. Got it. Captain, what do you say to lending these fine fellows a hand? I'm in. Me too! Beat sitting around all day. There you go. Meet your newest co-workers. And not just any co-workers. These Skyfarers have an impressive resume. For real? Awesome. Thanks. We appreciate it. And for starters, you think you could check in with a buddy of ours? <laughs> Let's kick some tail! But... <laughs> we probably should have made an appointment. Yeah. Oh well, we'll make it work. Dorn, get in. Feels like I'm in a maze. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Sigils? Got an order for a new weapon? Come again. Welcome. You can expect only the best. Please use it with care. Leave it to me. Leave it to me. Always strong. 
strive to be stronger. Perfect. Leave it to me. Take care. Got the word. Ready to roll up your sleeves? Here's the deal. Some bigwig lost something in the city. Something really dangerous. I, uh, can't handle it myself without my legs done in a jelly. Talk with an alliance rep. I, uh, left the details with them. Looking for something dangerous? Oh, you must mean that. Mm, yeah. I know a few folks that might be able to help you out. I'll write down what they look like. Go see what they have to say. you looking for a dangerous thing? Ah, okay, okay. Yeah, I guess you could call it dangerous. Try looking in places with shade, but be careful. Never know what might jump out at you. Wait, so the thing is alive? Ugh, this is making my beard bristle. have anointed me as their beacon. Raise your eyes to the blue. That which you seek may come from above. These are eyes to the blue? Um, what are you talking about? This can't be for that special love. Look no further. I've got a few more options. You're looking for something a magnet lost. Huh. That could only be one thing. Yep, no doubt about it. If it's what I think it is, you'll find it in an alley. Why can't you just tell us what it is? Oh, whatever. Let's move on to the next person. Look in the shade. Above our heads. Down an alley? Is that what they're telling us? Maybe. Guess it's time to start crawling the back streets of Sea Hollow. This bread is the bee's knees. Tell me that's the dangerous thing we've been looking for. It's just a cat. Geez, how dangerous can it be? Come on, let's get it home. The client is over the moon. <laughs> uh, 
glad that's over with. You could have just told us you can't stand cats. <laughs> when I was a kid, I got scratched by one. It left a scar on my body and my psyche. Ah, but you don't want to hear about that. Thanks again. I can't believe we went on a wild cat chain. Why would the family's Zafba bother with boring jobs? I believe being a good information broker means having a finger in every pie, uh, so to speak. In any case, we're making good progress. On to the next task. the hand couldn't have come at a better time we're assessing the castle's manpower but it's not like the gods will volunteer to take a survey i hate to use the term eavesdrop but we're short on ears if you see any castle guards could you listen in out of sight and without getting caught obviously Greetings, Skyfarers. Welcome to Seed Hollow. Ah, Jesus. But where can we eavesdrop without being noticed? Uh, that's it. <laughs> So my granddad said the craziest thing the other day. Well, don't leave me hanging. You know the Corridor of Peace? Know why they really call it that? No, why? It's to honor an astral who once saved the Sky Dwellers. <laughs> That's a good one. What a joke. That's what I said. They were the ones who conquered us. A compassionate astral. <laughs> Can you imagine? Now that story I'd like to hear more about. Unfortunately, it has nothing to do with our task. I've got a few more options behind the counter. Remember, keep it hush hush. Who are you people? There's nothing to see here. Uh oh. Zothba's subordinate was right. We have to stay out of sight. This spot looks good for spying. Shh. Heard the news? Yeah. They raised the threat level for the Skydom. They keep sending reinforcements to Tempeel and other islands. Castle defenses will be stretched thin. It's taking a toll on the public safety team, too. The Church of Avia has been popping up everywhere. At least we're safe here. Don't have to worry about Seed Hollow getting invaded. Just hope I don't get shipped out. Mobilizing soldiers out of Seed Hollow is sapping the castle's defenses. People might get edgy if this leaks. I know what I saw. That Harvin was wearing white robes. Match what was described in the intel report to a T. They say that uniform stole out to one of the deadliest groups in Avia. Obviously, the Silver Wolf Corps is also nothing to sneeze at. But this group uses strange techniques. Uh, I should have arrested that Harvin. What if they've already infiltrated the city? Avia may have already infiltrated Seed Hollow? That's bad news. But, good to know. I think we've heard enough. Let's go report this in. Spruce up your home with some new color. Paxtos tune? How'd it go? I see. I guess we'd better offer some resources to bolster the castle's defenses. By the way, didn't you say something about needing to see the boss? He should be in by now. Why don't you head for the bar? This saucer guy sure likes to dip his talons in everything, huh? Yes. 
Thanks to him and his informants, the city's managed to stay relatively peaceful. But I'm going to do him one better and protect every single dweller in these skies. Really? Are you sure you're not biting off more than you can chew? Oh, was that too much? Anyway, time to hit the bar. Everyone, meet Zafba. Some jam. Yeah, I was hoping you could help. Let's talk business. You didn't let me finish. We aren't a charity. Selling info is how we don't starve. And the juicier the intel, the tastier our meals. You want a seat at the table? You gotta bring the bread. Know what I'm saying? Loud and clear. And you folks don't strike me as the type that can afford our prices. I'll say. Those hefty ship repair bills add up pretty darn fast. How about a proposal? You scratch my back, and I'll scratch yours. <sighs> we really don't have time for this. <laughs> don't pass on a deal till you've heard every last detail. We've already looked into the mind sealer around your friend's neck. The catalyst stone that'll cancel the magic sleeps in some ruins on Dolly Island. Are you absolutely certain? Let me guess. You're giving us the scoop because you want something in return. <laughs> Man knows how to cut to the chase. All you resourceful folks have to do is break the seal on those ruins. It just so happens there's hidden treasure in there we'd love to get our hands on. And those are the conditions. Not a bad deal, if you ask me. Yep, we both get what we want. Seems fair enough. At this point, I think any lead is worth investigating. The choice is yours, Captain. I'll be waiting at the port. Come see me when you've got your answer. Mr. Shade back there was no ordinary dude. Okay. Oh. Right then. Right. No way. Oh. No way. Excuse oh. me. <laughs> oh dear. How do you do? do? So then. Oh. Oh. Right. I think you painted a different picture of the guy, Roland. <laughs> uh, well, he's very passionate about his work. Yes. We didn't come here to dig up treasure for someone else. I know it's not the most direct way to get to Lyria, but it's better than nothing. Why did it have to be Dolly Island, though? Not to mention breaking the seal on the ruins. But if we don't take that risk... I suppose Sothba knows what he's doing. What are you mumbling about? Come on! He said he's waiting at the port! Good tidings. Zalpha wanted to thank you for your hard work. Something about finding hot gossip and shady cats? Kite bearing work sure is something else. <laughs> Enjoy your gift. What you in the market for? Sending out the old crew signal, eh? Who should we vote?
buy an airship? I can get you one wholesale. Get it? <laughs> Let us venture forth! When we'll fuck. Excellent choice. For the skies and her people. Find the time to kick back and relax. I'm sure Lyria will fall in love with this beautiful city. It's gonna be great showing her around. Excuse me. Discount free. Buy yeah. one, get one. Buy from me and you'll agree. This I don't got all day. Are we doing this or not? Pleasure working with you. Good. Neither of us wants a fine business opportunity to slip through our fingers. Um... Hey, this is out of the blue, but I might have some personal things to tend to. Oh, say what? You're gonna flake on us? Uh, while you check the ruins, I'll look for the red ship. It'll be more efficient. I appreciate the thought, but should you go after them alone? There's no need to worry about me. I promise. I always finish what I start. <sighs> Thank you, Roland. We owe you so much. Take care of them, Zafba. Are you telling me how to do my job? Who's wearing the informant pants here? Oh, <laughs> you, you got me there. What was I thinking? Oh, but at least take this. Well, well. A transceiver. I made it with my own two hands. I'd like it back when this is over. <laughs> Better hope it doesn't fall apart on me then. Now as a small bonus, our family's pride and joy will fly you to Dolly in style. Be careful out there, everyone. Ooh. 
What is this? Join my collection. Before you ask, this ride's free. Make it worth my while, Skyfarers. Dolly Island. That's where we're going to find the Catalyst Stone to free Lyria from the Mind Sealer. This is our last thread of hope, and nothing's gonna make us let go. Not even a waking nightmare. It's okay. Come, the stars await, and we mustn't keep them. You were tossing. Do you feel all right? Yeah. And how are you feeling? I feel fine. Why ask me such a question? I... <gasps> I found it. Another god. As we fly closer to the main island, an ocean of sand seems to stretch on forever. Large ruins break the surface like icebergs. It's time to start digging through the past, because in one of those tombs lies the catalyst to our future. Ha <laughs> ha! Tomb raiding, eh? My fish shall blast us back to the past! <laughs>
still there. Actually, surfing down dunes might save us time. Just don't wipe out and eat sand. Uh-oh. Is that a pack of wolves? Over there! Looks like a way into the ruins! Remember the seals Zothba was talking about? They may be around here. Shade makes all the difference. Oh, very nice. When was this structure built? Despite the wear and tear, it doesn't seem that old to me. Probably has a complicated history, like every other tomb with buried treasure. Join my collection. in the middle of the desert, you gotta light the whole thing up. The contraption you're after is probably sleeping soundly beneath it. After you break the seal, we'll be collecting our treasure. Sounds simple enough? Yes, in theory. But we all know these sorts of places are riddled with traps. Nothing's free in life. You want the catalyst? You gotta work for it. Skyfarer's job never ends. Keep one hand on your weapon at all times. Hey, it'd be boring if all we did was step on tiles. Mr. Let's start by exploring up ahead.
So we need to make this whole circle glow, huh? You've got it. It's basically a trap door to the vault. Once you activate all the keys, the door will unlock. And that sweet, sweet treasure will be mine. Uh, you mean there's more than one key? Yep. Remember the first one you stepped on? Just do that a few more times. And they're scattered throughout this whole desert. At least our sight lines are clear. Should be easy enough to spot them. Delightful. Huh. That's a weird looking piece of rubble. What do you think it used to be? A grand building, no doubt. All that beauty lost forever. It just breaks my heart. Okay, that's a golem. Or this Skydom's version of one. I wonder if they imported the technology Destroyed from Earth. Was it guarding something? Please don't move. Please don't move. Battle, but we managed to pull through.
Good work. You're making even better time than I'd hoped. An Earth spirit. No doubt its powers are augmented by this land. Here we go! Your mom! Attack! You know, I think I'm starting to get used to this guy now. Stop of steel! <laughs> Going from freezing mountains to sweltering deserts ain't doing my body any favors. to be a tower? Probably. And judging from the look of these ruins... Hold on! Something's coming! Fallen warrior, eh? What say you to one last brawl? I'll pummel away your last regret. Look at this! Over here! Over here! Over here! Yep, 
Move out. The honor is mine. Let's see the young bucks do this. Good stuff. Yep, that'll do. Love it. Old dogs do learn new tricks. Can't wait to try this out in the field. Yes. Learn me something good. Lovely. Yep, that'll do. Ooh. Yes. Ooh. Stuff. something good. Love it. Lovely. Yes. This desert is much bigger than I thought. 
We'd be lost without Zothba nudging us in the right direction. You know, I've been wondering why the catalyst is buried here. This island must have some impressive magic. No! I've got your back! Ooh, that yeah, butter's shit. got biscuit! Yeah. Let's see. Not bad. <laughs> Got a beat on! Is that a griffin? I'll tell you what it is. Trouble. Ranged attacks are our best bet against that flying beast. How'd you folks get mixed up with Roland, anyhow? It's not that interesting. When we first came to the Skydom, we bumped into him on Folka. We're lucky to have met him. Sandy. He's been nothing but helpful. <laughs> Man's too kind for his own good. Always sticking his neck out for people. It's here! Weapons out! It's just like hunting ducks! Big old angry duck! I won't let you down! Got something for you! You reap what you sow. Bring in the big guy. Here's a fun trick. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Keep it together, folks. Do it. Coming right out. Hit him all at once. Uh -huh. A good battle. Right through. Uh -huh. Got you coming. Here's a little payback. He's pouring it on. He can only take so much punishment. Now then. Just move this carefully. there. Let's just hope nothing interrupts us. and grab the loot. I've got a date with that treasure chest. Now for the moment of truth. That catalyst better be there. Should be sitting pretty on its own tailor-made pedestal. I don't care what you grab first. Just don't forget to bring us back our box of riches. Now 
Now then! Once we have the catalyst, it's only a matter of time before Leary is free again. These punks again. If you want a beating, we'll oblige. You took the words right from my mouth. <sighs> Who said that? That stone is a captivating prize. Unfortunately, I can't allow you to claim it. <laughs> Damn. are my kindred. Failed, my lady. Oh, 
Very well. Since you insist upon testing the sword veil. Is impressive, but how long before it breaks? Your time's up. Here, faster here, the fist, blazing fist of the Red Lotus. Say what now? You reap what you sow. Yep, here goes. Head fist, blade. Shot is one. The astrophysic. Here's a fun trick. How about no? Obvious generals are no joke. My, my, this is all it takes to impress you? I don't think you've been broken as much. Here it is, Cory Alberti of my magic sword. Shall be dazzled and pierce your heart. Into my trap. You said it. I got you covered. Oh, I dare you scuff my blade. Even the sturdiest steel can ruin my blade. Death and you all have fallen. That was great. Oh, sacred of the veil, reveal thyself. Sword Ultra. Here's a little payback. Yes, 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 Thanks. Catch this. Catch this. Where she has, the weaker her defense. <laughs> How about no? All of the doors are shattered. It's now or never. This should literally be now. Here's some support. Got you Here's a little payback. Arise, my stubborn blade. And now for us two. I would have been happy stopping it at once. See you in there. Enjoy this journey. Savannah, I'm here. I'm 
having a hard time keeping track of it. We don't destroy those weapons. They'll have us dancing to her tune all day. Yep. Your time's up! Here. How can you treat a masterpiece like that? Should be able to get the old Lyria back. Come in, crew. Oh. Is everyone all right? Hey, it's Roland. Is the Grand Cipher back to 100%? Yes. We're on our way over right now. You're getting it done. Thanks, pal. So, any news on the catalyst? We sort of ran into a minor hiccup, but it's safe in our hands now. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Great job out there, everyone. I'm coming to pick you up now. Thanks. Let me wait. Roger. I won't fail!
Feels like overkill for a glorified treasure warden. Perhaps I should have. I need intentionally generating this action. 
maybe. I mean, it seems like overkill to slap a primeval god away just to keep us from getting a catalyst. Uh, okay, I gotta ask. Are the primeval gods the same as primal beasts? Never heard of these primal beasts. All I know is, the primeval gods safeguard their respective islands. As for my humble opinion, yes, Bird. I believe they are the same thing. Every Skydom has its own history and culture. Some local lingo is bound to be different. Roland certainly seems knowledgeable about this subject, doesn't he?
Bright alive, but things haven't gotten any better. Put everything into the next attack. It's all or nothing. Ooh, 
same. My dogs are barking. Hey! Oh. oh yeah! <laughs> I'm glad you're safe, Vern. And the catalyst? Do you still have it with you? Got it right here! Thank goodness. And all that's left is to rescue Lyria from Avia. Yeah! There's still one problem, though. How do we find Lyria when we don't even know where to look? I've got that covered. I discovered where the red ship is going. Whoa! Did you really? Mm-hmm. Yes, really. They're heading to a place called Fondem, the Scarred Isles. Magma flows deep beneath the land. Not exactly what I'd call an ideal vacation spot. It almost sounds like a volcano. Why would they go there? I'll explain on the ship. Come, back to the Grand Cipher. Hey, folks. Sorry to butt in. Me and the boys are gonna park ourselves right here. If you come across any curios while you're out there, come see us again. I'll trade you some great items for them. Thanks. Might take you up on it. Fair prices and no hidden fees. Happy to do business with you. Hmm. You folks are tough. But if you really need me, just call. I'll come and run it. In the meantime, try not to kick the bucket. Got it? What's this? So then. Found some. time before we get our Lyria back. With the catalyst in our hands, we board the Grand Cipher to go after Avia again. Next stop is Fondum. Just a short hop step and a flight away. It's been roped off as a danger zone, which, yeah, isn't ominous at all. The church is headed there for one thing. Yet another altar housing a primeval god. All of Zega Grande's gods or, I guess, primal beasts, are a force to reckon with. But we can't let Avia keep exploiting Lyria's power. If they force her to commit atrocities, once this is all over, she'll never forgive herself. Thick black smoke blankets the sky. Rivers of fire flow below. Yeah, pretty much the perfect stage for a fateful showdown. Well, here's to hoping we make it out in one piece. There, we're moored. Red ship shouldn't see us from here. We'll hit them before they know what's coming. I'm not the only one who saw that big-ass fire geyser, right? No, we all saw it. Only a primal could pull that off. Then it's clear that's where they've taken Lyria. Prepare for take... What now? I believe it means the volcano is close to erupting. How are you so calm? Lava is not how I want to go out. And what about the Grand Cipher? But we have to get to Lyria. You're preaching to the choir. Of course I want to go rescue her, but I just... Ugh. I saw how they handled Excavalion. It could be my best bet going forward. But we'll be stranded here if we lose the ship. 
It would all be for nothing. All right. I'll take the helm and fly the ship to safety. Once the area stabilizes, I'll come back to pick you guys up. You all go on ahead. Sorry for the trouble, Roland. Sure you don't mind? Not at all. Besides, since when has Mr. Fixit ever let you down? Ah, uh, before I go. Vern, do you mind showing me the catalyst? Wait, right now? Um, sure. No problem. There, I've activated it. Hold it near Lyria, and it should release the lock on the collar. And that'll give us a fighting chance! Thanks, Fixit, dude! Hmm. Time to part ways for now. Danger lurks around every corner in this place, so proceed with caution. Don't worry about us. You just focus on keeping the Grand Cipher safe. Come on, everyone. We need to hurry. I'm sorry, Skyfarers. Lilith was my responsibility. Everyone good? I need you all to be ready to kick some tail. stuff. Anything different about Roland? Not really. I mean, I guess he seems kind of tired. He's helped us out of more jams than I can count. Let's get him something nice once this is over. Beast is nearby. Aha! I spy a chirp thing. <laughs> Stay back. Right behind. 
behind you! Why is he fighting that primal beast? Your guess is as good as mine. All I know is he's the reason Lyria's here in the first place. Volcano's getting ready to blow! Oh no! The crowd is sinking into the magma! Can't do anything about it! Just run for your lives! Don't look back! soon, right? That primal looks quite similar to Bahamut. Is that why it was able to imprison Lyria? Why is it taking a dip in the mag? Oh, yikes! It's a magma wave! Get swallowed by that and it'll eat more than a nasty burn! Get to the cover of that outcropping! It's our only chance! Wave in half? I don't know whether to be grateful or terrified. Both, I guess. Let's hide behind the rock and let the wave. Stop! We're not finished with you! Hey! Where does that worm think it's going? I'll hunt you down. Ugh, we were so close! Come on! We have to chase it again! Uh, this volcano isn't gonna blow anytime soon, right? That primal looks quite similar to Bahamut. Is that why it was able to imprison Lyria? Why is it taking a dip in the mag? Oh, yikes! It's a magma wave! Get swallowed by that and it'll eat more than a nasty bird! Get to the cover of that outcropping! It's our only chance! Now's our chance to close the gap! Wave in half? I don't know whether to be grateful or terrified. Both, I guess. That's our cue! Keep it up, guys! Why is he going that far? Could he really be trying to save Lyria? I mean, even if he does, he'll just take her away again, and we're back to square one. My thoughts exactly. Can't let him do that. It looks like they've come to an impact. Now we can join the fight. Another wave is coming! Japan! 
here. Do you even care about her? I already told you it has nothing to do with you. I have. Like another chase is afoot. It's running scared because it knows the catalyst worked. Our next encounter will be its last. You know it. I'm going to give Lyria the wake up call of her life. How'd they get down there? Let's face it. If you want to take down this god, you'll need my help. All right. We'll work with you for as long as our goal is alive. Don't even think about taking off with Leary after Scale is down. I've got my eye on you. You're just blowing her. It means our attacks won't get through. Bert, let's do what we did before. After we create an opening, you use the catalyst. Got it. I'll be ready. I'll for you. Gotcha coming! 
finish this! Oh, 
Having second thoughts? Maybe there's hope for you after all. It's coming out of its days, but I'm certain we're wearing it down.
it. <laughs> oh, what a pity. Grief and misery make fools of us all. Here I see a troop of puppets flouncing about in a play with no audience. And your bond with the shaman? It's threadbare. Little more than a thin line of hope. Fear not, and trust me with your strings, and I shall deliver salvation unto you all. I know this is much too sudden for you to comprehend. But don't struggle. Embrace it. Now then! Come, let us end! Our knights of obvious leader Walk come to greet us for sex. They've got the trouble of tracking you down. My dear, I'm not looking for a fight. I've come to extol the virtue of salvation. Quick! Get a new armor or nothing! Give us a fair fight! She's screaming with power! Oh. The priest even gets close to her! Okay. A pity that you will Such not leave me. Such unbelievable What's that black aura coming off of her? Take that! I see your dear. I at an end. Your crew is largely to thank for that. Acknowledge my vision. And salvation shall come. Isn't it obvious that I am shepherding all to a transcendent future? We don't need your phony baloney philosophy. As skyfarers, we put our faith in a free sky. Then, the time has come to pen a new chapter in this saga. It has been a long journey, but a fruitful one. Now, to open the gate and bask in the light Fire! of paradise! Stop! What are you doing? No, we'll all be... Why must you reject salvation? Do you not see that it is the perfect course? You dare defy me to the end? I'd rather not harm you. That would not be in the shaman's best interest. So I ask, judge for yourself. The miracle of my salvation. Ah! Huh? That's dirty! Give it back! Why? This has always belonged to us. I admit, I am intrigued as to how you were able to activate the catalyst. Although, I suppose it no longer matters at this point. With the primals in my possession, I've won. She knows how to make a strong cage. My powers are useless against it. Damn it! We didn't come this far to get put in timeout! There is still hope left. And now even Vulcan Bola has fallen into Lilith's hands. I can't stall any longer. The fate of the skies calls upon the might of your crew. 
Will you fight to save it? Roland, I'm not sure if I like where this is going. Yeah. Tell us what this is all about. Of course. But first, your injuries need tending to. Let's return to the ship. <sighs> the time to reveal the truth has come. Let's do it! Well, the floor is all yours, Roland. Thanks. First, I want you all to take a look at this. That's the beast from Tim Peel. Furikin. Lilith released the primal beasts from their slumber and stole their powers. Those powers now flow within Lyria. She's essentially a living storage vessel. <laughs> the Astral Realm is Lilith's home. One way back is to restore the Forbidden Primal. Angra Mainyo. I hope I'm wrong, but she plans to feed it the other beast's powers. Just how big and nasty is this my new thing? It's the primal beast of gateways, allowing all kinds of travel between any two points. Distance doesn't matter, so in theory, one could even pass through to the astral realm. Doesn't sound that evil to me if all it does is open a bunch of doors. <sighs> if only it were that innocent. The problem lies in what's needed to open a gate. You see, the gates require energy proportional to the distance between them. Now, let's pretend we want to open a gate to the Astral Realm. In this case, distance is secondary. Now we're discussing interdimensional travel. So, energy-wise... Yes. An extraordinary amount will need to be consumed. And that instantaneous consumption will trigger grave repercussions. At best, Zega Grande would be reduced to nothing in the aftershock. At worst, most of the Sky Realm would cease to exist as we know it. There's no way that's possible! Then let me tell you a story. Fifteen years ago, Lilith revived Angra Mainyu. She attempted to open the gate to the Astral Realm. Fortunately, for whatever reason, she failed in her scheme. But a number of islands weren't so lucky, and they were rendered uninhabitable. Survivors of the incident are forever cursed to live their lives with unending trauma. That's awful. You see now? She won't give up. She will utilize the power of the Four Primals and attempt to cast open the gates once more. And the only thing waiting for us on the other side of those gates is sheer destruction. We can't allow history to repeat itself. There's something I'd like to ask about this woman, this Lilith. She's an astral, isn't she? The potency of her powers and her obsession with the Astral Realm give her away. <sighs> the Astrals. The invaders who once ruled over our skies. You are correct. Mm-hmm. Well, it takes one to know one. I suspected as much a while back. You knew a great deal about this Skydom, 
Things that no ordinary person should know. I'll be damned. A real live astral right under our noses. <laughs> Sorry. Can't blame a guy for being on edge. Is that... Those are obvious raptors! You're kidding! They really chased after us? They couldn't have mobilized a hunting party this quickly. Of all the times to hound us, they choose now? Well, they're here. Less talking, more blasting. Go, go, go! Take the shit! Take the shit! Ah! Ah! You what are the heck? What is she doing? Her magic is just like that. Level. Ah! On my hope for a more peaceful through. flight. Ah! How did they find this route? It's those interlopers! Stay in formation! We must take this ship! They seem just as surprised as we are. It might be a coincidence. All squadrons shoot to kill! Lady Lilith has decreed these heathens be purged for the nefarious scheme! Unfortunate timing on our part. Stay alert for more. It just occurred to me. There's only one destination at the end of this flight path. Which means we're headed to the same place as these jokesters. Indeed. And let us discuss particulars after we have saved our hides. It took it too far. It seems conviction is a strong motivator. Well, when you got an astral okay? yank, you change. Bless you. There's my backup! Run in! I'll follow your lead! Looking good! Just like that! On my mark! You can fight us! One! Power number! Finally! That was the last of them. Looks like Obvious already making their next move. I must take action. Wait, I just want to be super sure. Are you really an astral? <laughs> you wouldn't be the first. We've met other astrals before. Loki and Mikaboshi, if those names ring a bell. They have their own particular philosophies. But you seem different from them. I know, right? It's like Fix-It-Dude actually wants to be a part of the Skyrim. Indeed. It was no act when you risked life and limb to save the people of Folka and Tempeel. I'll be honest. I once viewed Sky Dwellers as insignificant. But that all changed many years ago. The first friend I ever made in this world taught me a valuable lesson. They said there is strength in solidarity. Understanding can overcome adversity. Help us grow. Volka is now my home away from home. The people there are like family to me. Sadly, we experience longevity on different scales. If I were granted one wish, it'd be to stay with them forever. At the very least, I want them to be happy. I'll do anything I can as an astral to protect the populace. To protect the islands. And I'll stop Lilith. No matter the consequences I must suffer. We understand how you feel. The Sky Realm is our home too. So you can count on us. I guess even astrals come in all kinds of different flavors. Just like Sky Dwellers. The same can be said of primal beasts. Heh. <laughs> Kinda weird having an astral watching our backs for once. But I won't complain. Thanks, everyone. I'm sorry I haven't been up front with you all. I suppose I was acting out of cowardice. I was afraid of your reactions. If you learned I was an astral. We're in this together. <laughs> Captain. Thank you. 
Yes. With Roland's aid, we'll surely stop Lilith and rescue Lyria. Angramanyu's real body is in an altar beneath Seed Hollow Castle. Yikes. There's a sinister primal lurking right under that huge city? Yes. And I'm the one who sealed it down there centuries ago. But if Lilith found Angra 15 years ago, that means the seal is... Broken. When she squandered away Angra's power, she failed to capture its true form as well. I'm certain it's still in the altar somewhere, camouflaged by its gateway powers. Uh, so that's why you stayed behind in Seed Hollow, to find the damn thing. Indeed. Unfortunately, my search turned up nothing. However, the moment Lilith summons Angra's real body, that may be our chance to strike. I warn you, she and I are equally matched. But lucky for me, I've got the better team. Apia is no doubt getting closer to the castle. There's no time to lose. We'll gear up in the city and make a run for the altar. Or else these skies are done for. Don't mind if I do. now, huh? We better hightail it back to Seed Hollow before it's too late. So, we've suddenly found ourselves caught up in an astral tug-of-war, decades in the making. The relationship between Lilith and Roland remains unclear. But one thing is certain. Roland is our greatest ally in Zega Grande. And with all the good he's done here, his love for Sky Dwellers is plain as day. Together, I know we'll stop Lilith, and ensure Angra Mainyu's gate stays closed. We will protect the Sky Realm. Seed Hollow is burning. Another victim in Avia's desperate mission to return to the stars. This all started because I brought Lyria to Zega Grande. And now our battle is intertwined with the fate of the Sky Realm itself. We need to get to the heart of the city and fix the damage that's been done. to assess casualties, I'm afraid. Not when we know Avia will make a beeline for the castle. I suspect we'll face a tough road ahead. Everyone, prepare yourselves accordingly. Oh, you back already? Look, you've scratched my back in the past, so I'm willing to give part with some intel, free of charge. Regarding the city, my people are out surveying the damage as we speak. Early reports suggest, strangely enough, that Avia isn't focused on taking out the commercial district. Instead, they're concentrating on one area and one area alone. The castle. 
Considering they've got a force of 5,000 strong, you'd think they'd try to occupy more. But here we are. In addition to the ground troops, they've got manned and unmanned aircraft to boot. Not to mention, the Silver Wolf Corps and the Sword Veil seem to be acting in concert. First time for everything, huh? To be completely honest, the whole thing makes me mad as hell. I'd like to jump into this circus and pound a few chumps myself. The city's well-being comes first. You just go smack their leader a good one for me. Got it? They'll all sleep better once she's out of commission. Avia is focused entirely on occupying Seed Hollow Castle. I fear Lilith is wasting no time. She's not sparing numbers either. There's a million of them swarming around. We don't need to engage with all of them. Cut off the snake's head, and you don't have to worry about the body. Thanks for the assistance. I would never abandon one of Zeta Grande's most vital trading hubs. It's not in my nature to watch a crisis unfold from the sidelines. By the way, Captain. I don't know if you've heard, but the castle is under attack by the Church of Avia. That forced each of the city's wards to declare temporary lockdowns. I'll be around until the brouhaha settles down. Give me a holler if you need anything. We can't let Avia get away with all they've done. Take this, and go show them who's boss. Chosen well. Need a pro, eh? Hi, Barry. Damn. God damn. We'll enter the castle through these doors. Everyone ready? 
Ready. This time, I'm coming too. We'll save Lyria. And stop Lilith once and for all. Undercroft should be just down this corridor. Man, those poor seed hollow guards. They didn't sign up for this. Yeah. What? Hey, little item. Cleared out this area. Get out of here or face the Silver Wolf Corps. You idiot! It's that crew! Lady Lilith will reward us generously for their heads! Don't back down! We have the power of the primeval gods on our side! Primeval gods, huh? Amazing how that term persists. 600 years after I first formed Kavya, Lilith and I were working on our experiment, studying the effects of stifle emotions, such as faith on primal beasts. But she twisted the convictions of the masses, reshaping them as building blocks for this paramilitaristic cult. Lady Lilith will guide us to the promised land. We do not fear death! Inquisitor Rook's troop will be here soon! Hold on till then! <laughs> that was Wait just the warm-up. Come on! Understood! Great I guess so. Glad to be of service. Let's keep it up. This crew fights now as one. I'm fired up. The church finds you in defiance of Our Lady's grand message. Face your penance. Now we have to deal with full on battleships. This is not in my job description. We don't have time to repel all of them. Stopping Lilith comes first. Wait, Roland. Weren't you the one who sealed Angra Mainu? Indeed. 500 years ago. You couldn't find a better location? For Sky's sake, putting a primal like that under a damn metropolis. Forgive me. It was the height of the war. And I needed a place inaccessible to an actual like Lilith. So you chose an enemy stronghold. Not exactly a conventional place, but effective nonetheless. How dare you fabricate these lies about Lady Lilith's astral origin? You will learn to stay your tongue, interloper! Let's go! This crew's really seems expectations. We can team up anytime. Shine is one! Prominence square! Perfect here. They best with the best. I'll stop you in your tracks. You're dust. Look no further. I'll follow you, Lee. Keep up. One more. Over here. Finally broke through them. Onward and downward? These soldiers are not to blame for Lilith's machinations. And yet they're the ones paying the ultimate price. A little debris won't stop us. Allow me. Yeah. So you can clear rubble. Think you can clean an airship? What's the pay like? Shall we talk price? Quickly! The Undercroft should be close.
jerks do not play fair. We can take refuge in the cellars below. There's no way their fuselage will reach us down there. I just hope they stop firing completely. This castle's too pretty to be destroyed. Gonna take half a miracle to bring down that carrier. So do we run, or...? <sighs> Judging from the position of this tower, the terrace leading to the court should be close. Let's head there. Now we face the interlopers who routed Rook and his men! A Lady Lilith! Yeah! A Lady Lilith! Wow, guess some people can't help but play with fire. Oh, 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 get behind you! You foul oh, interloper! Oh, we will not let you stand in the way of our glorious victory! Oh, you've got to be kidding me! Do you even know what Lilith is planning to do? How dare you question our lady! You will die for salvation! The act on those no. men! You're wrong! She would swallow this whole sky to see her selfish ambitions fulfilled! You included! Just that! Just as she did 15 years ago in Dolly! <laughs> Who's with me? Cover it! Need this! Bring it! Your handiwork was exceptional! Good knowing I haven't lost my touch! How's this? One more! We got this! I'll support you! We better stay focused! Wait! Oh yeah! Let us see this through! I'll draw their attack! Infinite wonder! Break the limit! Ray of Fury! Assist me! Ungar! Got him in my crosshairs! Well done! You know what I'm saying! Keep up! Let's go! 
This thing has a head harder than Rackham. But he doesn't move like the wind. The legs should be lightly armored compared to the core. That's where we should focus on fire. Break the limit! Yeah. Change of weaponry? Everyone, be on guard! You listen up! This is fear! Has no equal! Cast okay, here goes! Not now, not ever! Oigen! Yep! destroy such a fine specimen. Hold on, you hear that humming? I don't think we're out of the woods yet. Now we have to fight two of them? Allow me. Uh, don't mind if I recruit a little help. Seems undamaged. I could use it to fight off the others. Did you really just hop up on that thing? Do you even have a life? Where we're going, we have no need for life to It'll be a thing to cover you. Why does Roland always get weirder around new machines? Yeah, I don't like that twinkle in his eye. No, cop now. Why must you criticize me mid battle? Can we focus? Prepare our cannons. We have to give our reinforcement Kayuit our time to come online. Yeah. Hell yeah! One down, one to go! Won't be the us! They should know that won't leave a scratch on this puppy! More cannon fire! Hold steady, Kai with us!
Is it? Never fear. I'll have it removed post haste. an entrance to the undercroft from the front of the court. Let's hurry. You're all mine. Excellent choice. Give it my damnedest. <laughs> this tea is simply to die for. There's no better appetizer. To a banquet of blood! I knew you'd be back for more! In the name of the Sword Veil Fellowship, I shan't let you take another step. Let's have a clean... Death match! For your main course? Then how about an ass kicking for dessert? I can wait for this. Gotcha, come on. It's getting obvious who's strongest general. As you can see, my poorish behavior is in need of some entertainment. Not I think we've rather perfected it! Yes! Let it be told! 
of the mighty Galanta Extravaganza! Excuse me, the what? I deserve credit too! Oh, why? Part of life is right through! I won't let you down! Not Ooh, I'm a 
of my position to be making demands of you but please the sword veil are my family if you can find it in your heart to spare them take me I sticked my life on this death match now come claim your hard-earned spoils uh, look we just want to get through here without trouble. As long as you stay out of our way, we got no reason to fight anymore, deal? There's no time to waste. <laughs> Forgive my failure, Lady Lilith. Complete and 
utter defeat, they might actually pull it off. Let's see. Not bad. Those two freaks were crazy. Crazy strong, I mean. Oh, I hope we've seen the last of them. They were masters of their respective arts. Why did they follow Lilith? Even great warriors may find themselves prey to hard times. Salvation, no matter how false, seems an alluring prize. And, well... I'll look after you. Some astrals have a certain charm, which can prove intoxicating to many Skyfarers. They've got all the nasty tricks. But what about Lilith's son? He an astral too? Mercifully, no. He's... The Sky Dweller, same as you. As far as I can tell, Lilith took him in as a child. Not every day you hear about an astral adopting a regular Joe. Whatever's going on here, it don't sit right with me. It seems we've reached a dead end. Not to worry. There's another path this way. Hmm. Satisfactory. Here we are. Would you all please stand back? No doubt find Lilith there already. Special ward warps time and space around Angra, making physical contact impossible. Let us hope Lilith has not breached it yet. We have only one shot at victory. I will strike the moment she calls for Angra. So when it gets its fuel, blast the engine? Yep, that'll do it. Okay, people, look alive. This one's for Lyria. I hope these potions will be enough. It's been so long. Finally, the dawning of salvation is upon us. The path will soon open. <sighs> oh. I wasn't expecting to see them again. That's enough! Lyria's coming back with us! Is that so? And... Astraeus! It's 
been a while, Director. <laughs> been waiting for you to return and cast open a gate. So I can destroy Angra Mind you!
the way of the throne. I got you back! I'm gonna protect the group! I'm like any monster or primal beast I know. Maybe the Lilith is pumped and full of destructo juice. I believe anything at this point. Extinguish it? That momentum is a double-edged sword. We we'll have a chance to strike as soon as he stops charging. Catch this! Understood! Over here! What a terrifying torrent of mana. He filled this entire room in an instant. Yep, that speed is a serious problem. Well, he can't just dash around all day, can he? We have to find his weak spot. Hang in there. I know how to take him down. Look for the gap right after his rushing attack. That's when we strike. You won't prevail. Are you all right? His attacks activate that weird fire. We have to be careful.
Is he... is he actually down? Let's just get to Lyria. You always were such a careless one. Get ready. <laughs> the primal beast who distorts space itself. I can't believe it overpowered Roland so easily. This fight is going to get desperate. Stay vigilant. sky dwellers are all leave. And I am winter of discontent. My coming is your death. Even Astraeus was no match for me. I could likely blow you over with a single breath. Why, you stop this! Get away with your nasty scheme! Cut up your suit! Let's run! We must hold this position, even if its spells are doomed. Hunger Mining cannot be allowed to escape! Lyria, burn! Stay back! Things are bound to get serious. Okay! Be careful, Catalina! Uh, I'm not much of a fighter! If I notice anything suspicious, I'll tell ya. <laughs> Still 
think you can stop me? What a quaint thought. I'm afraid your little crew is all out of options. Now, join your lost friends on the other side. No one gives a crap about your evil plan. Just give our friends back. Hear me? That's this. What a great little worm. We're going to make you pay. There's no way you can get away with this! Burn! 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 Now, dear Captain, you deserve to be rewarded above all others for bringing the shot to my door. Bear witness as your entire world crumbles. Should I see you in the next life? Catch this! It will be too soon. Oh, everyone, save yourself! little bird trapped by these skies let me whisk you away on a journey aboard the ark of angra mainyu other half. <laughs> Id, explain yourself. Mother, you told me to protect Lyria. But this... Why this? This isn't what you said! Why did Lyria... Calm yourself, Id. Angra Mainyu has been revived. Thus, the shaman's role is complete. Consequently, your duty as her guardian is no longer needed. But, Mother, please! Temper, Id. It almost sounds as if you disagree with me. My naughty child, you're no better than these interlopers. Forget about me! Focus on your Ling! may very well crumble. Adversity only seems to push you towards victory. After all, you must be confident you can prance out of here as the hero. Don't be. Humdrum tales of heroism and gallantry have no place on my shelf. Let us finish this charade! Shining 
blade, the sword of Eos. How lovely of Astraeus to leave you a parting kiss. Wait, you cannot possibly mean to use it against Angra Mainu. <laughs> the mere sky dweller should not have the magical reserves to wield it. Enough! our chance.
Evil dragon, child of darkness and flames, thy name is... I think. What the hell happened? It appears the Captain and Lyria restored everything back to normal. Way to go, Captain! Man, it's hard keeping up with you young bucks. Always stealing the thunder. <laughs> well done, Captain. Where's Vern? I think we can safely say, all's well that ends well. 
<laughs> I want to apologize to everybody. Even though I couldn't control myself, I could still see everything that was happening. All the scary stuff I did, I was powerless to stop it. I wasn't sure if it was a dream. That wasn't you, Illyria. You all still came to save me after what I did to everyone. To Catalina. And especially to you. It's okay now. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Dry your tears, Lyria. You're back with us now. There's nothing to fear. repeat itself now I understand you're all influenced by the singularity but fate set in motion can't be stopped you will come to understand the depths of my unflinching resolve the astral realm awaits the fruits of my research I won't be denied Estelucia Stop. If you open the gate to the Astral Realm, this world will be destroyed. Angra was sealed for a reason. Does that mean nothing to you? Let me ask you this instead. Why do you care so much about these skies? They're so full of heartache and despair. Worries that shall be long eclipsed by the providence of a new order. You're blind, Lilith. Blind to their kinship. Blind to their hopes and dreams. There are things in this world that be more than power or... Fix it, dude! <sighs> no, Astraeus. All that is obvious to me is that we don't see eye to eye. And you're as guilty of the same sins as the rest of these fools. <laughs> Hear my voice. Deliver us from grief and sacrifice. Fulfill my salvation. <laughs> to the astral realm. <laughs> 
Salvation follows at my heels. The sky will fall, and the stars will ascend. Utopia is within my grasp! Are we... back at the altar? Would seem so. Everybody, run! <laughs> <laughs> Look! What is that? I don't know. It just came out of nowhere. The end? Hurry! Get a grip. Go lace up with daggers, crew. Yes, sir. How's the second district holding up? about rolling. Hey! It's Mr. Shane! Well, what do we have here? Oh, and you folks got your friend back. Hello. Nice to meet you. My name is Lyria. I'm Zothba, an information broker. Must have been tough out there, huh, little lady? Um, yes. It was. Zothba, do not frighten the poor child. Huh? Who's being scary? I'm on my best behavior here. <laughs> it pleases me to see that everyone is in good health. I came to lend my support the moment I caught wind of Avia's assault on Seed Hollow. Speaking of allies, I don't see Roland with you. Where'd he go? He's been captured. Ah, oh, crap. Well, look, don't get too down. He's not one to croak without a fight. Maybe we can do something for him, though. <laughs> you in, Histy? Most certainly. I am off to make arrangements at once. All right. Call it intuition, or an overactive gut. But an epic storm's brewing in this here skydom. Don't know how to explain it, but the air's buzzing with emotions. Stuff like joy, anxiety, sadness, anger. You can tell when it's coming to a head. <sighs> I haven't felt this spook since the Dolly Island disaster 15 years ago. My point is, you folks ought to haul it back to your own Skydom. What? You can't say that at a time like this! Look, my sources tell me you hail from Fanta Grande. You've got a fine ship that can cross the Grim Basin. No need to play hero here. It's not like that. We can't just leave everyone when we know what's coming. Lilith is going to use something called the Pillar of Vayoi to destroy the sky. Do we just let her do it? And what about Roland? Let me be the voice of reason here. You saved your princess. Mission accomplished. So what do knights do after rescuing the damsel? They make sure she stays safe. You're an excellent captain, and so I don't need to spell out your next move for you, do I? We're gonna save Roland. I'm glad you're looking out for the man. But did you hear a single word I said? Come on. All I'm saying is don't push your luck. Ah, oh, who am I kidding? We both know I can't talk you out of this. 
But Zega Grande is our home. At least let us keep our pride. Be seeing you around then. And quit with the long faces. We can handle this. than eating apples. Mm. Great work today, team! Expect only the best. This turned out fantastic. Leave it to me. It's a great success. Let me show you what my master has taught me. Always strive to be stronger. for coming. Welcome. Enhancing your sigils?
well. Got an order for a new weapon? Which weapon shall I strengthen? Always strive to be stronger. You can expect only the best. Come again. Take care. told us we should get out of Sega Grande, but... Roland made it abundantly clear that Angramanyu is more than... Sega Grande's problem. That power can and will consume the skies. Exactly. Ah, welcome back. Grand Cypher's good to go. Are you ready to leave? Let's fly. The air currents have become unstable. Keep your wits about you. So, are we really doing this? What's the plan? We're going to save the world. Anything's possible if we work together. Think of all the people we've met in this Skydom. The precious memories we've made. We will protect Zega Grande. Defying an astral and a forbidden primal beast. <laughs> Quite the mess we've stumbled into. Too late now for second guesses, right? Whatever happens, we just have to win. Hang tight, fix it, dude. We're a coming for ya. Let's give it everything we've got. A more fearless crew there never was. <laughs> Let us wish them well. 
They're the perfect folks to defy primeval gods. I'm kinda glad it's them, and not me. And so our debt to them grows heavier once more. Well, enough yammering. We got our own work to do. Hey, this is Rollins. Must have dropped it during all that hubbub at the castle. Be sure you return it to him whenever he gets back, eh? Excellent. Exhilarating. Impressive. Test this. Exhilarating. Impressive. Wind's running wild today, but it's nothing the Grand Cypher can't handle. We finally have Lyria back. There's not even time to celebrate. Lilith is so close to her goal, she's become blind to everything else. I doubt there's anything that can stop her now, except us. It might sound melodramatic, but this is fate. Our crew versus Lilith. There's only one thing left to do. Fly to the Pillar of Vioi and end this. The sky's a shocking shade of despair. Guess we got Lilith and Angra Mainu to thank for that. That pillar scares me more. Lilith called it the bridge to the Astral Realm, right? Only Angra Mainu can open the gate. That pillar must be like an altar for the rites. Let's move out. Look at the very top. Ah! That's the life the gate came from. We have to go investigate. Even if I have to lay down my life, I will stop Lilith. Hmm. Is that 
satisfactory. What hole did this weirdo crawl out of? It's part of Angra Mainyu. Okay, so it's creepy and hostile. At least it'll be a good warm-up before the final match. Reinforcements! Are those little yeah. ones also uh, part uh, of uh, Angra Mainyu? Uh, yes. But these actually have physical shape. Yeah. Huh. I think our attacks will work. Stay focused. Uh. Uh. Whoa. What the hell was that? Put this away with you. Too slow. Uh, ah, yeah. weird portal just uh. opened up. Yeah. Think it's because we trounced all those mini mine you? Right? It looks like we're still in the same place, but everything's all hazy. Look, the monster from before. Is it just me, or does it appear solid now? I bet it's because we went through that funky portal. I knew it was a good idea. Stay focused! Stay focused! I don't think we'll make it very far in this haze. Let's pass through the rift again and return to the normal world. Well, now that those spooky portal monsters are gone, what say we get a move on? I can't believe they were residing in a different dimension. It must have something to do with Angra Mainyu's powers as gatekeeper. I'm as shaken as you are, but at least we have a strategy now. You all know the drill now. Wait for the mini mine use to pop up, then blast them. Heads up, crew. Oh, we got spooky company. Calm down, Rackle. They seem like normal monsters. They must have been summoned here by Angra Mine. Oh, 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 What? Not yet. Now! You got it! Dang, Oigen! <laughs> Still got it! Great! Meeting shadow people in a shadow world! Finally not where I wanted to be right now! I don't think mortals were ever meant to step foot in this realm. Let's try to stay by the portal, in the light. You're finished! Take me instead! You've given me courage! Ask you more! Stay focused! Stay focused! Do it! Really? I hope we never have to do that again! Hey, shadow portal, shadow people. What's next? Isn't Angra mine you? No. It's... Huh? But that's impossible. Lyria, we're hopping between dimensions. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
The wind's about to blow me over. Hey, phony kid, you're not angry. What are you howling for? I'm now. It's concentrating power. Watch out! Ew! I tried oh, cutting out those whirlwinds. Definitely don't touch it. Revenge comes first. Thank you. Talk later. I don't trust your hero act. After Furikin's dusted, I'm gonna make you spill your evil master plan. <laughs> Push. 
one go! This won't prevail! This'll show up! Is anyone hurt? I feel like a million rupees. But, uh, what are we gonna do about him? Kid, <sighs> wait! You want to stop Lilith too, don't you? After all the time I spent with you, I know how much you care for her. But even if you love her, after what she's done, we have to stop her. My mother. Or Lilith, I should say. Intends to sacrifice the future of this world. I know I can't let her get away with that. But I can no longer feign innocence. This has gone on long enough. Wanna come with us then? <laughs> you wanna stop her and so do we! Choices don't get any easier than that! How about it? We can use ya! Why? Considering the scale of violence I inflicted on your crew. You did help us. <laughs> a past enemy is a future friend. That's what they say. All right. I'll join you in the fight against Lilith. Let's stop her. <laughs> Let's do this. Welcome 
to the winning team, Ed. Yeah. You're not much of a people person, are you? I'm sorry. <laughs> Adoptive. We're not related by blood, but I owe her my life. If you want to turn back, no one will blame you. I've made my choice. You might say that now, but when she's right there in front of you, it's gonna be tough. I'd rather face her myself than have her suffer at someone else's hands. As family, you must feel responsible for her crimes. Very well. We'll respect your wishes. Kid, there's something I wanted to ask you about. Last time we crossed swords, you transformed. Oh, yeah. What was it? Let's see. If you ask me, I thought you looked okay. like a giant lizard. Well, you're wrong. It was a manifestation of the dragon power sleeping within me. Lilith trained me when I was young. Taught me how to control them. I thought I'd be saving the world with them, but... You will be, kid. That's the whole reason you joined us on this crazy mission, right? Um... Ed? What is it? I wanted to thank you for protecting me while I was imprisoned by the Church of Avia. You're thanking me? I was the one who captured you. Yes, that's true. But you also helped bring me back to my friend. If you'd left me with Lilith, who knows what would have happened to me? Yeah, I guess. Not bad. Hmm. I think I'm having deja vu. It. Those monsters share a body and powers with Angra Mainyu. Defeat the small ones first. Understood. Fire! Rain, oh, stop! Take this! Not this one's for you! Uh, I'm not scared of this creepy island! Uh, yeah, 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 Let's do this! This will show them! Your instincts guide you. Break it, man! You're mine! Well done! Never! We got this! It's over! Whoa, cool spell! Oh, that old hex? Just how many of these shadows are there? One more! It's over! Attack! I'm on it! Oh. Eat this! Oh, this one's free! This is my 
So not only was it a counterfeit primal, it never truly huh. existed at all. Don't mind if Correct? I do. Yes. I think it's because time and space is so unstable here. Reality is getting all mixed up. But who ever heard of a shadow with the destructive force of a primal? Vayoi truly is fearsome. Tanya. It's even tougher than the real mana garment. Be careful. Get lost. Captain, yeah. I'm ready. Tempest, flame. Right up. Loud and clear. Have no ego. Ego, I have just the spell. It's over. Shine is one. Time of chaos. Now that's teamwork! Oh, oh, what the hell is this? Some kind of mating dance? Ugh. Is everyone all right? It's got us pinned down. We have to do something. Yeah, I know, but what? I recognize that spear. <laughs> no one goes hunting without a silver wolf! Huh? What are you doing here? Heard you got something great, I I got you on my wall for a few more groupies! He's not talking about mounting our I hope not. I'd much rather have Delonza as an ally than a foe. <laughs> no autographs till after the fight. Yeah. Mistakes. Uh, 
sentiment. I am Ace. I'm just here for the thrill. Of course. What the? I still ready. Does this mean the party's finally getting started? <laughs> It's over! Back to it. Try not to move! This is... my breath. Wait, you're gonna sleep here? 
We owe you a long time. It, I've always wondered. When you were part of the church, why did you go to such lengths to protect Lyria? It was only following orders. At least at first. Lyria was the key to bringing salvation. But then you learned all Lilith wanted to save was herself. Lyria was no more than a means to an end. Once she had made Lyria absorb enough primals, Lilith meant to free Angramainu and sacrifice all who opposed her. I gave myself to Mother's cause. I trained and trained to protect her vision of salvation. When I learned it was all a lie, my life was devoid of meaning. There was nothing I wanted to fight for anymore, except Lyria. Now I'm protecting her because it's the first thing... a look at that. Who knows what'll happen if we touch it. I sense something. It's the primal beast from Fondom. Please tell me that's a bad joke. We don't have any real estate What's to this? fight on. No! We've reached a dead end! By the way, uh-huh, aren't you? But I suppose etiquette can wait. First, a dance! Appreciate the help, but uh, I've had my fill of bloodlust and carnivores. I never. Would you kindly refrain from comparing me to General Galanza? I am here as a matter of pride. You could have gone out with the vanquishers of my dear fellowship and suffocated in a bomb. But it's the end of it. That's me. Because you've only seen the opening act. 
The sword veil allied itself with Avia to bring salvation to the skies. Now at last we can rise to the occasion. Curses! Let's patch you up! Fresh! Fire! 
Mistake, Skyfarers. This was merely a matter of honor. Do not disgrace yourselves by thanking me. And so, I bid you adieu. Whew, I can't believe we're still breathing. Oh, 
frozen thing. If Gale hadn't come, we'd probably be s'mores by now. It's too soon to celebrate. Come on. That's how it's done. Ready for action! Can't wait to try this out! Ceiling's gotten higher. Should mean we're almost at the top. The more I see that sky, the more I hate it. Yeah, Lupus got some messed up taste. This should be the last battle. Make sure you're prepared. to the astral realm? It looks even scarier up close. Strange, isn't it? Gateways are usually a symbol of hope and new opportunity. Not this one. Like Roland said, if that door opens, then the skies will fall. We won't let it open. Yep, we'll beat Lilith, grab Roland, then skedaddle out of here. Sounds like a plan. Had you only seen things my way, this pitiful fate could have been avoided. Why must you insist on quarreling with your own brethren? It's unfathomable, truly. <laughs> ah, shaman. Impeccable timing as always, I see. Can you feel the grip of imminent salvation? I invite you and your other half to watch. <laughs> and it is this betrayal. <laughs> hmm. Where did I go wrong? You can't sacrifice our skies to open that gate. We won't let you do it. Once I reach Estelusia, I shall guide this world to Utopia. Why would anyone reject my heartfelt invitation? Ah, <sighs> how I pity you poor misguided creatures. Yeah, like we give a crap about anything you say. 
Your messed up utopia is built on sacrifice. No way we're letting that fly. <sighs> Options fail me. I can no longer sway your hearts or minds.
mine! I see through you! Celebrations, but we're not done yet. For a fraction of my soul, I'll buy all your death. Her power's flowing into Angra, mind you. She's attempting a fusion. Is she that desperate to live on, even if it means she'll stop being an astral? Keeper, Angra you. I beseech you, bequeath your power unto me. Take this vessel, I am yours! Something terrible is coming. Too powerful. I don't understand. Why are you so invested in our skies? There's so many of them! Don't let the pressure get to you. Just focus on beating them one at a time. You have my aid. Pleasure will just keep coming. How are we supposed to get to Angra Mining now? I 
think I can buy us some time. I need everyone to gather around. I love it when other people make a plan. Fight your way to rolling, everyone. your ship, unless you plan on walking home. Quite a raucous affair we have here. before it gets more out of hand. to join us one. The world rests in our hands. What fun is a death match if my opponents are already dead? This is the moment of truth. Do not falter! Whatsoever you decide, we will follow your lead. Each shot costs us a mill. Okay, so what? Those folks are betting their lives out there. Just shut your yaps and keep firing! Everyone's here! Our bonds are stronger than ever. We shall prevail! Let's show her what's up, Captain. Us Sky Dwellers are taking a stand. Yeah! Ready, Captain? No sweat, right? We're all here for you. Let's Take this! Together! There's nothing oh. these fists can drop. Let's do this. This is the apocalypse! It's over! I hear ya! Get ready for the coolest fireworks you've ever seen! Yes. Enough of this madness! The skies are counting on us! Let's this up! Yep. You know what the best kind of fight is? The kind that never ends! I swear on the Sword Veil Fellowship, you will not get past me! They're holding back the Shadow Army! Now's our chance to get Lilith! Yes. You really do take some beautiful Lilith. 
This is the power of emotion. The undying light of the heart. Oh, this is where our research should have led. To the strength Sky Dwellers derive from love. Of a home, of friends, and of family. But somewhere along the way, you turned our eye. You found a window it's into the over. darker emotions of the mortal mind. You preyed on fear and desperation, making empty promises, aggrandizing yourself until the people worshipped you as a god. You took advantage of their faith and raised armies that overran the Sega Grande Skydom. Think back on all the violence you've incited. Does that really look like a path to Utopia? Your megalomania is a threat, no matter where you are. I will never let you return to Estelucia! Understood. Never ask the snake. I guess I'll go now! Don't pay! Why? Blazing trip! With the red motor! I heard you! Captain, I'm ready! Shine this way! Shine this way! Ascension! Trying to sacrifice a world. Is it really worth it? Reporting in! 
sins are grave, too great to measure. Don't you see? You were wrong to think of sacrificing this world and its people. It's not too late. It... I'll accept my fate, so please... truthful with you from the start. divine right. The sky is once more yours to sunder and renew. Primeval dragon, child of darkness and flames! <gasps> you can't! Spread 
your wings and burn it all to ashes. Ashes as white as your beautiful locks. Perhaps it will be this cycle. You will heed me. Make your mother proud! It's okay. Let me be the one to save you. Huh? Perhaps I acted in haste. So swiftly you sensed the dimensional distortion. Oh, meddlesome wings. You who defy the stars. You will sleep within this child, until I have further need of you. <laughs> Come, the stars await. And we mustn't keep them. The true beginning stirs. Id had become a dragon, and vanished into the somber skies. His roar, which echoed like a distant peal of thunder, electrified me with sadness. <sighs> Can't believe it. I thought if we beat Angra Mainyu, we'd be free to go on our merry way. No kidding! Why did Id have to go off and become Bahamut? Right. In which case... Hey, what are you thinking about, Rowan? It's like you've got all your gears whirring. It's starting to come together now. Especially if she used a Mind Sealer on him. The Mind Sealer is what they used to rob Lyria of her free will. What does it have to do with Bahamut? Everything. Lilith and Bahamut, destruction and rebirth, everything is linked. How about giving us the gist? Essentially, it 
comes down to why Lilith failed to wake Angramanyu 15 years ago. I heard the Sky Realm's Bahamut appeared after sensing an overwhelming astral presence. Perhaps that was more than rumor. You call that the gist? I'm even more confused. <sighs> Sorry. Fifteen years ago, Lilith summoned Angramanyu. At the same time, Bahamut manifested to face her. But this was not the same Bahamut you all know. Let us call it Bahamut Versa. It sensed the unfathomable power of Angramanyu and consumed it. Stopping Lilith in her tracks. But now... Perhaps, to remove Bahamut from the picture, Lilith trapped the Primal inside it, using the Mind Sealer. Okay, but that doesn't explain why she suddenly freed Versa. Does she want to wreck the skies, or what? She once told Id that she would destroy the world to bring about its rebirth. Versa is more than capable of forcing reincarnation upon the Sky Realm. In any case, we know one thing for sure. If we leave Versa to its own devices, it will be the end of all life as we know it. You gotta be kidding! How are we gonna defeat a world crusher? And what's gonna happen to Id? You aren't asking us to kill him, are you? <sighs> Not gonna happen. Thank you. He doesn't deserve death. <laughs> We've still got a debt to settle with that punk. Can't let him off so easily. How do you know Id's still in there? Even Bahamut's got nothing on Id. Exactly. Guy with a stick that far up his butt? Even an apocalyptic dragon couldn't push him down. Even if we can't get through to him, he'll survive a beating. He trounced us, right? <sighs> I've been around for a long time, but you Sky Dwellers never cease to surprise me. I never would have dreamed that a single crew could save Tempil, or pacify Excavalion, or defeat Angra Mainyu. But you've taught me that it's not longevity or physical strength that's important. It's the power of your heart. You have my complete faith. I believe that nothing in all the world will keep you from saving your friend. It's settled. We snap Versa like a piñata till it pops up in. Yeah! Yes. Hey! Precious. I mean, even the god of destruction can't bear to lose it. Our bodies might be mortal, but our hearts are infinite. Though he's in a dark place right now, I hope Id doesn't lose sight of that. But even if he does, I'll open his eyes again. I, this crew, will never abandon someone we care about. The sunrise spills over the Grand Cipher as we rush on the winds, chasing the sorrowful cries of a faraway dragon.
help you. Me too! Thanks for the support. I won't waste it! Is perfect. And yet, <sighs> it seems the binding is only half effective. <sighs> <sighs> It's up to you. You must save it. of all beings. Life gives way to death, and death begins life. Our attempt to intervene with this process may have far-reaching consequences, but I want to believe in the limitless potential of sky dwellers. I want to believe you can rewrite even the laws of reality. It's hurting really bad. A fine plan. Sad and empty. We haven't known each other for too long, but... I can feel it. You wouldn't want things to end like that. We just have to save him. Who cares if you're stuck inside Bahamut? I'll crush you out myself if I have to. I am okay. I mean, you're dead. You were betrayed by the woman who raised you. Made into a dragon's vessel for 15 years. And yet you, a mere mortal, survived. If I should fail to rescue you, I don't think I shall ever forgive myself for the rest of my long, long life. In the past, I had nearly existed. It wasn't until you sky dwellers let me into your hearts that I learned what it was to live. Unlike immortals, you are capable of change and growth. All I want is to be a part of that. To help you build a glowing future as an astral, I am also to blame for the failures of my people. And I swear to you now, I will set things right again. <laughs> It. Gods are a little beyond our skill level. We need more firepower. I think you mean dragon power. Lyrian, do you feel up to summoning Bahamut? Okay, just give me some time. No kid, I'm in full agreement. For I four. trust you with my life. Oh, I'm going. That not it's the light of the apocalypse. The fire of Doomsday, its power is transcendent. If the attack lands, all the skies will be obliterated. Please, stop this! No, the one in the Hurry and wake up! Surrender! Carry this! I'm mistaken! Yes, it's Kenona! Stay focused! 
Lord has a hold on him. But now that he's human again, you have one last chance to rest him completely free. I don't know what to believe anymore. You should at least believe in yourself, Lucas. Think back to when you were fighting to protect the sky. Did that feel like a lie to you? No, because that was what you actually won. Right. What? Whenever you feel confused, just follow your heart. It might lead you to carry through this. But at least you'll know you're being true to yourself. Surrender! Four, four. You have to remember! I... I want to be a defender to all of you, to Lyria, to the skies! What? That's a giant grin! <gasps> It must be the gate to Bursa's whole dimension! Bursa is now a manifestation of sheer power, with no vessel to contain it. You won't be able to linger in this world much longer. If you can just weather these next attacks, the day is yours! Right. If I can get rid of Bursa, I might finally find it. Next. All right, Bursa. Let's see how you like a taste of your own medicine. Powers against you. Even though there's so they much at stake, still We're veteran skybearers. This ain't our first apocalyptic rodeo, and it won't be our last. If I had a rupee for every immortal buck we kick, I could probably buy my own island by now. I don't mean to get mustard, but I'm really proud to be a part of this crew. I feel the same way. I won't let anything happen to you or our world. Our journey can't end here. It's not water. We're going to take some dragon tail and go on sailing to the end of the sky. Here it comes. The tempest flames. Leo. Yep. Oh, oh, the red star. Oh, star. Shine is one. The astrophysic. Very then. The end is in sight. We're going to grab one. The red star. It sooner. No use running anymore. I am who I am. Oh. <clears throat> An evil dragon, child of darkness and flame. Absolutely amazing. You've suppressed Versus Core and driven it back to its home dimension. Everyone safe now? Thanks for everything. <laughs> you can buy me some apples on the way back. Huh? We're still not done.
Leave this to me. Wait, where do you think you're going? Forgive me. Hmm. Kids these days, you two are totally nuts. <gasps> Let's roll into you, Bernie. You okay, man? Where are you? Hmm. Good question. Someplace far away? Hey, this ain't the time for jokes. He and Bahamut are trapped on another plane. Think of it as a sliver between dimensions. Still, considering his transceiver seems to be working, For now. Sadly, I think my time's almost up. The line's going to get cut earlier than I'd hoped. Thought I'd still be able to open a gate from here. Guess not. I thought there was anything we could do. Sure, just stay calm. No need to worry about little old me. I'm Mr. Fixit, remember? There's no jam I can't get myself out of, you know. I'll make it. Oh, One last thing. So until I get back. I can tell you back there, man. You can check in on the people of Fort Dunn. I don't want to lose sleep, but I need to be stuck in this bed. <laughs> We bumped into Roland when we first arrived in the Zega Grande Skydom. I have to atone. Huh? For Mother's crimes and mine. 
Come on, no need to beat yourself up, kid. That's right. We couldn't have resolved this without you. said it was fine, right? Yeah. <laughs> one of us now, not me. Never forget everything you've done. Never ever. <laughs> and when we find Roland, we'll give him the thanks he deserves. We've met so many people in the Zeka Grande Sky. New friends. New allies. We saw a man torn in two by family and betrayal. We were saved by an immortal who found beauty in our changing world. Through loss and adversity, our resolve brought Lyria and I closer than ever before. Yet this story is far from over. A good friend is still out there waiting for us to come get him. And as for our journey, there's still much to see. To the ends of the skies, where the stars reside, someday we will reach Estelosia.
gonna do now I think we should start by finding Roland's house if memory serves he was living at the church but why the sudden interest the church got it hey he didn't even answer you Guess we still need to work on his people skills. Well, at least we know where he went. We should go see what he's thinking. Phantom! What you doing here, Id? Huh. Looking for a way to save Roland. This place is replete with his memory. We really appreciate it, Ed. You chipping in to rescue Roland. I owe him just as much as you do. More, even. I feel bad intruding on his home without permission, but there might be clues around. Wanna help us search? Hello there. Did I hear you mention Roland? Huh? Oh, yeah. You a friend of his, too? So my ears didn't deceive me. We've met before, remember? At the docks of Tempeel. Oh, you're the guy that told us about Hallowed Ground. The very same. But, um, back to Roland. Would you happen to know where he is? I can't seem to get in touch. Oh, he's... he's... um... He's somewhere far away. Yeah, really far. It'll probably take him a while to get back. That's fine. I just wanted to be sure he was safe. Knowing Roland, he'll probably wander in through that door when we need him most. Though, to be honest, I hope that's sooner rather than later. Why is that? Something wrong? Well... As you may know, in addition to being a vicar, Roland was the local Mr. Fixit. And I'm not just talking repairs. Monster hunting, herb picking, he was a real lifesaver. But now that Roland's gone, there's tons of work that's going unfinished. I'll do it. Huh? I'll take up his mantle. Ah, this is so painful to watch. Will somebody please teach this kid to speak like a normal person? I think meant to say he just wants to be helpful now that Roland's gone. Right, Id? Right. Oh, well, that's very kind of you. But, um, how do I put this? We were comfortable asking Roland for favors because we trusted him. While you certainly look like an upstanding young man, you're still a stranger. No offense. But I... We'll help out, too. Great idea! Hey, mister, we aren't strangers. What have we tagged along? Well, all right, if you insist. I have to say, though, you've done so much for our city. I feel guilty piling more work on you. You 
you sure about this, Captain? Yeah, it's what Roland would want. Um, thanks. Well, now that everything's settled, I'll forward all our jobs to the Crew Alliance for fall. Whenever you feel like taking something on, head over to the quest counter. Thank you, again, and best of luck. It's everyone's favorite crew. Perfect timing, as usual. Truth is, I just put out an urgent cry for help. We got a caravan strong-armed by goblins in Skyworm Valley. I'm looking for folks to beat off the half-beasts and retrieve the stolen goods. Might be a tough battle, but think you can head out now? Yeah. Knew I could count on you? Take care of yourselves, you hear? Today, it's Big Fixer Upper debut. Let's all do our best to help him. Find the goblins, recover the supplies. Sounds simple enough. It will be. Combat's your forte, isn't it? Our gobbers. I'll make this quick. What a yeah, that's perfect. All or nothing. Right. You're out of luck. Don't let that one go to your head. My name's me. We have to get you healed quick. Yeah. Harris. Miserable mist. It, it's over. Harris. Yes. It, it's over. Forward. Got a knife cross here. Look out! Here comes the backup brigade! We'll manage. Keep picking them off. Dang it. Glad you're on our side now. This is a cakewalk. Did you hear that? That would be of help. Follow me! Got him in my crosshair. Where'd you learn how to do that? I got plenty more tricks up the old Let's grab the stuff and get out of here. This should be it. Let's move on. Something's watching us. Stay sharp. More goblins. But they shouldn't be much of a threat. I don't know. I don't weird they're attacking with such a small band. Agreed. Though I don't sense reinforcements. Enough. Here's the Follow me! Cover it! Oh, the Wyvern! It's called Skyward oh, yeah. Valley for a reason! Brace yourselves, everyone! It sure explains why there weren't many goblins. No, local goblins should know how to defend themselves against Wyverns. I knew it, Craig. That was just the war! Do it! It's over! Oh, 
He certainly has a knack for them, doesn't he? You really can leave it to Mr. Fixit. <sighs> hey, did you guys see that? Something big just flew by. Not part of the brief, not part of our problem. Yoink. More of them. Here they come. Something's wrong. They're all running, but not from us. Doesn't matter. We came here to do one thing. Destroy the wings of the top. It's over! The fun's just getting started. Understood. Great! I don't want to get left behind. Oh, yeah. What? Accounted for, so now we should have just one more. Didn't know you were such a poet. That wasn't half bad. Oh, Catalina, you sounded just like Sierra. Hmm. <laughs> Wait, no, I. My sense of humor is far less pun reliant. I don't get it. Was something humorous just now? Oh, it's, it's nothing, Id. Don't forget. All right, me. enough messing around. There's the last supply pack. We have to take out these goblins first. <laughs> Sure. Send me a postcard. Take this. Back off. Your mind. Stay alert. Explains why the goblins were fleeing. No one wants to be Griffin Lunch. Wasn't a request. You can't have it stirring up like more monsters. In which case, better take it down. Hey, now you're starting to sound like a real Mr. Fixit. 
Mission, I mean, quest complete. Now to bring the items back to the client. Yeesh, you're all business, huh? <laughs> Go easy on him. He's still new to all this. Hey, I heard about the job. Thanks a million. You should be thanking it. Yep, we couldn't have done it without him. Id, the citizens of Tempeel would be honored if you kept serving our city. And... Why well, be sorry? Uh... Um, I think Id meant to say that you don't need to apologize. That he's happy to help. Right, Id? Uh... Yeah. Yuria? When did you learn to speak Id? <laughs> I mean, doesn't he remind you of a certain someone? <laughs> right? 
I've heard rocks to talk more than these two. Wait, really? Uh, yeah. You mostly just go mm-hmm and uh-uh and stuff until you need to make a decision. Exactly. You might not talk the talk, but you certainly walk the walk. They never would have trusted me without your help. So thank you. No worries. Let's make Roland proud. We owe that guy our lives. The least we could do is help him with the housekeeping. Yep. Not to mention we even found his journal. Talk about a clinky dink. It truly is a priceless keepsake. His memories are etched across these pages. He must have been super busy putting out fires to drop this and not even notice. <laughs> I don't know. Our boy Roland sounds exactly like the type to have his head in the clouds. You know, if we keep running errands, maybe we'll find more of his belongings. Good point. By retracing his footsteps, we could discover a way to rescue him. Speaking of his footsteps, Id, if I may, there's one point I would like to emphasize. What? Skill wasn't the only reason Roland was so beloved. There was also the way he carried himself. How gentle he was. That's for sure. I'd ask Roland for directions in a heartbeat. So what should I do? Hmm, you could try smiling more. Okay. That's how someone would smile, if they were sitting on hot coal. Oh, I know! Id, why don't you try acting like Roland? We can start with how he talks. Just leave it to Mr. Fixit. Now your turn. Mm. Just leave it to Mr. Fixit. Uh, wow. We've got a long way to go. That wasn't so bad. What's next? Yeah? <laughs> 